criticizing, yes. Yeah, but that one, that one a little tough, boy. But we have to, we have to, hmm. we have to follow it. That one a little tough, but I still need to, um, to look for a mask that would allow you to, um, to breathe a little easier. All my, all my masks are not lying, you know. I have on my mask which has filters, so I have to change my filters as often. Retired nurse dies in crash. Griffith police ready to act. Huh. My God. AG 1000 fine for stepping out without mask. Once you are eight years and older and you step out of your house, you must wear a mask. Six charged for murder of Chinese national. Four locals and two Venezuelans have been charged for the murder of Chinese national. Um, Fang. Yes, Fang. I want to go to the next level here. During a breaking at the Happiness Grocery at the corner of Eastern Main Road in Batavia. Who's a Yulena? Huh? Who's a Yulena? They just give you this. When they, um, that's your name and uh -huh. take all the picture. Okay. See how they strip it? Police officers are ready. Police officers are ready to enforce the new mandatory mask law, says Police Commissioner Gary Griffith. Anger in Maruga, relatives, neighbors, and friends of fatal police shooting victim Venric Hudlin say he was killed in cold blood and called for the arrest of the police officer. Be honest about your symptoms. Some COVID-19 positive patients are lying about their symptoms and this could lead to death when it gets too late. Tell them. At least Anna Ramdas reporting something actually true. Retired nurse killed in crash. Retired nurse Patricia Kassoon Ruth was killed in a car crash early near a home at Barapo early Monday. Covered positive Gopi Singh goes home. Former Karani East MP Dr. Tim Gopi Singh, who tested positive for COVID-19 coronavirus two weeks ago, has been discharged from hospital. Elderly woman is COVID death number 22. The Ministry of Health this morning disclosed that another person has died from the COVID-19 coronavirus. Trinidad and Tobago gets an independent light, lightning show, lighting show. Lightning. You see that? Yeah, it's all wrong. <laughs> lightning goes out of field sooner, and thunder showers ushered in the Independence Day holiday in North Trinidad early Monday. All hands on deck, Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley has said, with all hands on deck, this country can survive the COVID-19 pandemic and make a national recovery in the face of difficult times. In delivering a television Independence Day address to the nation last night, Dr. Rowley noted it was his first address to his new term in office, and it is also at a time when Trinidad and Tobago has crossed a thousand confirmed COVID-19 cases. And those are some of the stories. Politician blamed for racial tension. <coughs> President disgusted by race rants. Cops raid Express House. Matt joins in a loss on a lawsuit. When is that? They're talking about the when the when the um police had raid Express House. That that, that no, thing. but this is the, this is um, yeah. I read it yesterday. What is this about? Is is the 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 the, the lawsuit that going on now? Okay. Matt jumping the thing too. Lucita turns 100 on independence. Was this police killing justified calls for cops, commissioner of police to intervene? Covered that count reaches 21. Plea for Trinidad and Tobago to help flatten the curve. In the news day, <laughs> I have to send condolences out to our former councillor, Akil Durham. An excellent young man he was, disciplined, well-educated and everything. Condolences.
on behalf of the constituency of St. Joseph, the Women's League of St. Joseph, the People's National, National Women's League of the PNM, and of course from right here at the Street 919 FM, Titans of Democracy. We send our condolences. Robinson Regis government not surprised by obstructionist opposition. Hmm. Pompeo Hall's US TNT links, or Hales, yes, Hales US TNT links. Tobagonian actor Winston Duke Bozeman was my mentor. What? Do you know that he died? I know he died. Oh. But what mentor he was to Duke? Look, Duke, keep it tail quiet, yes? His hero. He was a mentor uh, when he when he got big. When not when he was nobody. AG face mask being distributed <laughs> to socially displaced. AG outlines exceptions to face mask law. Dial Singh announces total game changer in testing. Doctor, COVID-19 patients must wear mask at home. Dial Singh UE to study COVID-19 changes in CARICOM. Visit from the virus. COVID-19 claims one more debt, number 22. PC investigate cops killing of Maruga man. Disgusted by ethnic rants, that's the president. Ragunath, political leader, have no respect for each other. Girl 15 reported missing. And those are some of the stories in the news day and in the Guardian. What says thou? Well, in the Guardian, Ian McClure. Mm -hmm. right. Children over eight with no mass in public face charges. If a child over the age of eight is found to be out in public alone without a face mask, they can be charged a thousand dollars in the first instance under the new public health ordinance, which was passed in the Senate on Saturday, came into effect yesterday. Hmm. Patriotic citizens start new independence tradition. It was August 30, 31st, Independence Day, yet there were no flag-waving citizen, no shouting of uh, marching orders, no drum rolls, no stirring renditions of the national anthem to be heard at the Queen's Park Savannah, Port of Spain yesterday. Residents protest innocent man's killing by cop. Health official begs home quarantine patients to tell truth. Health ministry orders 160,000 COVID rapid test kits. COVID-19 patients prefer home quarantine. Missing persons alert issued for superior man. U.S. Secretary of State extends Independence Day greetings to TNT. One new COVID death, national toll now 22. Iowa, Nyla, part of virtual Notting Hill Carnival. Prime Minister, COVID has created a $15 billion hole. Babies of COVID patients test negative for virus. Two more die from COVID-19, well, this is a little older. Sipasad race relations must be addressed urgently. Opposition wants national consultation on COVID. A minister applauds outreach efforts for student devices. And these are some of the stories making way in The Guardian at this time. I didn't see you say missing personal loot activated for Laramie Man. You said that one? Well, actually, it was Superior Man. Missing no, no, persons no, there's two. Oh, well, well I, I, didn't, I, didn't, I don't have that in front of me. Suspects escaped, but weapons seized after attempted robbery. Yeah. So those are the stories making ways in the news. Mm -hmm. It's 6.26 a.m. But Trinidad and Tobago, I came here on Sunday and we dealt with a story. Um... So I'll tell you a little more about that a little later on. But interesting, 
the behavior in Parliament. Hmm. Very, very interesting. And I'm saying, again, no platform this morning. What's up? Somebody saying that Tobago, they have no, not hearing anything. Well, I don't know. I just don't know what to say. I don't know. Don't know I can't help for you know. Let me see. All right. So we live on Facebook. So Joan and others, you can spread the word and let them know. We live on Facebook. I don't know what's happening in Tobago. We we'll send a text or something, now, please. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. What's the one on on um, YouTube again? Um, street, 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 live stream. Right, so you can see us on uh, YouTube also. No, 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 not there. Right. Good. So okay, so we live on YouTube also. Street, street, live stream. Look for us. We're right there. And please share the live. Please share the YouTube link. Please share it. Do not keep it to yourself. Share it. All right, so Trinidad and Tobago. I am looking to find where the behavior of a senator. Hmm, I know that, you know. I knew that, and I know it was going to be they were sent to disrupt the parliament. I do. I could. I could have said that in the earlies. There was no reason to hide it. But you see, let me see if I could find it here. Yeah, hold on for me. FM taking Sharon and Bruce Wayne, the titans of democracy. That's the morning show. Yo, Yo. this is your boy Ziggy Rankin, and right now you're listening to the titans of democracy. You don't know. Real talk. talk. Somebody will send it to me. I'm looking for it. My phone full of all kind of things. So somebody will send it. But guys, just to say that we have people who are very disrespectful and they have no respect for authority. Or they were just plain being themselves and be and, and sent there to cause havoc and confusion. So, I didn't expect anything different, you know. I didn't expect anything different. I thought that was the behavior of the person. And I'm wondering if this man has children or if his wife do not tell him, boy, you don't sound good, you know, and that don't sound good, you know. You're making yourself a public fool. I wonder if she could say that to him. Somebody going to send it to me. I, I want to play it back. I want to. Oh Lord. Let me see. Let me see. Somebody send something. So I'm going to see. Oh gosh. Wait. 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 <laughs>
right, so I got it. Thank you very much, Teresa. Thank you very much, the other person who sent it. But I need I need to play. I don't know. I know you would have heard it. But I want us to discuss this. You know? The motions were denied. Discussions were not had. Plans were not made. Senator and I'm Roberts. interrupted. Yes, ma'am. No. <laughs> together, I saw that we were not all in this together. The motions were denied. Discussions were not had. Plans were not made. Senator and I'm Roberts. interrupted. Yes, ma'am. No. Senator Roberts, you are so far from the bill that uh -huh. is before us. I would ask you, please, to please come to the bill. And I would also ask you, please, to just lower your voice a little bit. The acoustics in here are quite good, and there's no need to be shouting. Well, thank you for your guidance. I am definitely not shouting, Madam President. I was born with a loud mouth. I can blame my mother and father for that. Well, Senator so, Roberts, Senator Roberts, if that is the case, then try to whisper. <laughs> I will certainly try to make you happy. I notice that I've been interrupted quite a bit. It's okay. Sen Senator Roberts, listen. You are in the Senate. You are in the upper house. I would ask you to get your behavior in line and to also heed the advice. You're getting advice from the presiding officer. And there is no conversation going on between you and me. Okay? I make the rulings. You abide by it. Thank you very much, Madam President. And let me stay close to the bill. And you know that thousands and thousands and thousands of people listen to the Parliament channel. Especially children. Especially, especially the, youth, the young sir. persons yeah. now. And that's your conduct in the Parliament. You know, sometimes I hear people say, you could take a pig out of the mud and put it in a living room with carpet and thing and it could still be a pig. And I used to say, well, what do you mean by that? But this is just an example of that. You could want to be disruptive and you could want to politic. You could want to still campaign. You could want to be disruptive, you know. But you have to learn to have respect and discipline. And I can't understand how a big man can be bringing himself to this kind of embarrassment to be spoken to on so many occasions, but then, that is the mantra of the UNC. That's how they behave. And that is what you, you wanted to hoist on Trinidad and Tobago. If, you hear I say the word if, the UNC had won the election. That is what we would have gotten in, in a ministry. And as an MP in a constituency. Hmm. That's what we would have gotten. You have no respect for the chair. The woman, the, 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 preside, the president, the presiding officer, she's speaking to you. The president of the Senate talking to you and you continue. Where are we going? How far we want to go with this? I tell all you already and I'm saying it again. At the end of the day, we live here together. You know? We breathe the same air. We drink it from the same water pond, wherever it's coming from. We live here. And this hate and bitterness that has been spewed all over the place. And who want to take down who and want, and who want to bus mark, I tell all you, bring it on. Because at the end of the day, you think these people are going to turn back and look at you? Something has to be wrong with us. Exactly what the fight is about. We had an election. Somebody wins, somebody lose. We move on. You regroup and you start going again for your next five years. I don't understand that. But what I'm looking at Look at the persons who are being disruptive 
and think that they're doing so good for the leader and the, and the party that they, they, they support. And nobody not getting me to do that, you know, I tell you, no, you know. Nobody not getting me to do that. I ain't care how much money you show me. Do I look like a box my, on, on national, on, on to the world? My name is all I have, and I will die with the name that was given to me. <laughs> and at the end of the day, respect is earned. Yes. You earn your respect, just as I will respect you. So if you want to behave in that manner, and people look at you as a fool and continue to say what they have to say, then go right ahead. Elections done. I could tell you, I have UNC friends, and I just tell them, it's an election, we have no friend, you know, <laughs> in terms of politics. Pekong, Pekong. we think we're letting very respectful. And after that, election done, we gone with way. Everybody back to normal. But as some people like that, they can't control that. And they feel that they're the best mouthpiece. And everybody could hear them more than anybody else. But at the end of the day, who looks like the fool after? something wrong with us we easily easily controlled and some of us not looking at what we're doing and how we sound in if you want to pay me to do something that you don't want to do you have to pay me real good or tell me why you don't want to do it for yourself but I wanted to look at the whole dynamics of this thing have you ever seen or looked at any medium that, whether it be social media, television, or anywhere, and see an East Indian person coming to cuss another East Indian person? Watch out who they put to stand up out mm -hmm. by the by the the, the parliament. Mm -hmm. Watch them; they stand up holding a placard, using it again. If you all have an issue with your leader, come out and talk. Don't hide. Don't hide. We have had a lot of persons spoke against the PNM, members of the party who had issues with a number of things, and they spoke out. Yes, we go, I, go head to head. By the end of the day, you didn't see the PNM taking nobody to go and stand up with no placard here. But there's, a, there's, a, there's something a custom being done. Hmm. Take placard and make back and come here and lie to you and tell you all kind of things to make you feel sympathetic for the other person. But we must talk the truth. And you know the, you know the saying is the truth shall, shall set you free. I don't know. I don't know. I want to remind people when parliament is on a break and the tea room and so on, you feel that Dr. Rowley and Kamala Prasad Bissessa don't have a talk? You feel that the other, all the other MPs and, or senators, whether it be UNC or whoever, PNM, don't have a conversation? But you like a fool out here trying to make enemies with everybody while they're having a good time and knocking glass. And you're not being invited to none of the function for you to go and see. <laughs> like a fool. You ain't even reaching in the Philippines, neither the diplomatic center. In my house, your mom? Oh, let's stop at that now, now. Not in my house. Look, today is Tuesday. Anyhow, let me thank all the persons who donated their contributions that we collected so far. We went from from Mova to Shagonas to Kuva. I want to bring something for you. What's that? You take that down, you know, use it now. Yeah. yeah. But when I come out from you yeah, know. Let me say thank you and we still we still have the other phase. There's there's one or two persons in the south area that I forgot to pick up yesterday because we were running out of time. Tell you I reach home whatever hour last last evening. Um so I wanna thank you guys. The we have the east west corridor the east yes, the east west corridor to do. I'm going to be calling you all when I'm finished the program today. And those of you who in the Southland didn't 
um, I didn't get the opportunity to do so, I'll call you and tell you if I'm coming back today or tomorrow, or if I'm going to send someone, but wait for my call, nobody else, my call, to tell you what's going on. So I want to thank everybody who I met yesterday. I got, I got Barbadine, I got Five Fingers and, and Guava. I got, oh my gosh, thank you so much, guys. And to my, my, my UK friend, <laughs> she, uh, boy, and I couldn't come out of the vehicle. I was, I was extremely burned out. She forget to give me the coconut bread. <laughs> she was laughing like hell. Mm. <laughs> so I want to thank you guys. And of course, guys, just to report and let you know, the young man has been placed in an apartment. And uh, Village, Angie, myself, my daughter-in-law, we, we are going to be working. And anybody else who wants to help us, work with him closely because we have to get him some help with his anger management and so on. Um, so... That is that. So he's by needles. Mm. Mm -hmm. Boy, if it's the place. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> Mama, yo. <coughs> mm. So you have an opportunity to turn that page and change his ways. Because yesterday, somebody called me and they gave me some advice. And I took the advice. Yeah. I'm happy for it. And I told him about it. And I also told him that... This is not the landlord of the road that you had the issue with, eh? So you have to be very careful mm. how you tread with things and how you do things. Yep. Be very careful. Um, so, guys, we looking at the situation and see what's, what else can happen. We have some commitment from people to help out. The gentleman give us the place for a low rental rate. So we're going to be trying to see how much best we can help him out and um, then look for something for him to do near to the, the area that he is staying at this time so that he too can now make his own payment. All right? Trinidad and Tobago, it's Tuesday. Today is the 1st of September, hmm. 2020. It's 6.45 a.m. and I think we have to get ready for news Listen to you. At seven in a short while. Refresh your page. Yes. Right. So we're gonna open the lines. Three four two zero zero eight one. Four seven eight zero five nine five. And if you're calling from the US anywhere abroad or your magic jack at home, seven one eight eight seven four three eight six zero. <laughs> I don't like your ways enough. Morning to lobes. <laughs> Oh, God, let me even leave my alone, please. Caller, good morning. Good morning, Sharon. Good morning, Bruce. Good morning. morning. Happy Independence and Happy Republic coming up in advance. Sharon and Tobago, you see what we started to face already? Well, all we have to do is to do what we have to do. Next week, uh, 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 campaigning already for next election. You see what we had to do already? Mm. Kick them completely out. This is coming up with this is This is what you do to train and the bigo. Oh gosh. Let me say good morning to everybody. Mommy Sauce, good morning. Passy Street, twelve eighty five, Oga, Gemma and, and, and Morgan, everybody, everybody, twelve eighty five, everybody. It's Friday. Jackie and Jackie. Sharon, good morning. Bonnet guys and Mongo Blove are gone for now. Sour man. Oh Lord. And all you know. So I want to thank all the foreigners who sent us. So I'll be busy today. Caller. Morning, Sharon. Morning. Uh, two things. All black African conscious people or persons keep the fight up. Only when African fighting back, everybody jumping about about race, like talk about race and this and that. All the time Kamala they talking, nothing, you know. But as African people start to fight back, they want to start to talk about race. African people keep the fight up. They fall in, buying, no buy. Second thing, Saturday I think I was reading the papers, Kurt Mayhew. He had an editorial, I think in The Guardian or one of them was reading. He, he talked about PNM push, um, and he said, 
on 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 the parliament. What the hell wrong with me? You they had a vote. That's why it's called democracy. That's all I have to say this morning. Caller, caller. Yes. All morning. he all he simply have to do is talk to his political leader and call for a recount. That is all. Is is a damn um, um democracy. The call 21, for a recount. Twenty-one to thirty-four. He will be enforced. Um, and he said she was on the parliament. They didn't, didn't force, they, didn't, they didn't force Anil Robert Sonnets. They didn't force Jolene John on us. They didn't said, force he tell... nobody else on us. Listen to me, that is five years to deal with. Oh, and God. they had a, and the next five years, and another five years, 20 years in the deal again. 20 years. These people are sick in the brain. From a PNM. Enjoy your day. Thank you very yeah, much, Colin. Where are all of my callers? Not because we started a bit late. Guys, we had to do some sanitizing of the station. So, where are you all? You're still sleeping? Get up. It's all new normal. Caller, good morning. <laughs> a blessed morning, Mr. and Felix. I like the, the um, virtual with um thing. Yes, sanitize the... You yes. see how they have it there right now? I, 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 I satisfied with that. And the guy who talking up, Miss Miss Annie said George or Mrs. Annie said George. Mrs. Mrs. will be Mrs. approved. And George is one of the best speaker past to Trinidad and Tobago. And no nonsense person. Mm -hmm. And the speaker, the president of the Senate. I love you too bad. No nonsense neither. I'm not having no conversation with you. <laughs> well, what I'm what I'm saying is that. You know, think right? getting well. from your father is something else, you know, but when your mother beating you, she does beat you for time where you do things from time past. She brings everything to you in front of you. Remember this? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy morning. <laughs> that is why I say all you keep all your eyes in the parliament. Mm -hmm. What you think is in discipline is discipline production and tolerance we have discipline inside the parliament and they have to realize that all of them have to realize that they have to come under who is the speaker and the president in the house or look at one roughshod inside no no parliament there right now remember only the opposition and according to miss camille robinson regis yes they are the obst obstructionists Made Dr. Rowley on the campaign trail explain some of these things that these people obstruct up to this present time. And we and I I I, I would like to see that uh, according to our call let we stand firm and make sure we kick back against all wrongdoing in Trinidad and Tobago. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, caller. You know, and and and, and, and let me tell you this, eh? You listen to some of the people, some of their followers. Fine, it's okay. They're quite happy with that behavior, you know? Hmm. And happy with that. Since when you know 22 does go into 19? Mm -hmm. You ever hear 22 go into 19? Look, caller, morning. Sharon, good morning to you. Where were you, ma'am? Well, I am just there listening. <laughs> yes, 22 could go into 19. You know that? <laughs> 22 could go. Brucey, good morning. Good morning, good morning. I will tell you one thing. I don't realize already. See, 19, half of them will be outside the parliament and inside the parliament. Eh? Trust what I'm telling you about. Because if he big mouth and started disrespect already, right? Hmm. He's supposed to be shamed about asking mother and asking father. I know his mother, I know his father. I know your brother, and there was never, never like that. Bruce is supposed to remember these people and them. I don't know if you remember them good. You understand me? But you too disrespectful. You start already, you understand what I'm telling you about? But you go be outside the parliament more than inside. Trust me. Trust me, Sean. Bruce, you all right? Yes, darling, all right. What about you? What about you? I got, I got after God. You got after God? Yes, yes, yes. Oh. Okay, darling, and I just are uh, trying to organize. I have a little pain at Hamburg. I'm going to go by the doctor and check it out today. Right. You know, you know, again, young, you know, we have to make sure that everything goes because I want to make sure I make the next five years and the next five years and the next five years. <laughs> understand me? Yes, darling. I go, and you'll have a good one. When the level see good morning. <laughs> you have a good one. Thank you very much. Caller, good Bless morning. Blessed love. Blessed love to you, Miss Sharon Felix. Good morning. 
Yes, and blessed love to Mr. Bruce Wayne, mm-hmm. to the Lord and Tobago, blessed love. Because all I know that Gunther, you feel he, 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 he master. Yes, I call him master, you know. She rocked back laughing and she mind. That's why she planned this. That was a plan to bring he and the other footballer, all them. So, yes, the, the, he, he feel he have all the what and the what and the what he could come with. All the lists he bringing on the acting for this lady lists all half of the lists and them where, where he say we pay out with this body life spot. I don't care. How ask if all of them live in sin. All of them must be done dead and gone the way already. Who we'll never get a cent? They take that. Thank you, Daddy. They should we, charge him. We go they should to... charge him. They should charge him and all and pay him outside. <laughs> We're going to have a break, guys. We'll be back and then we go to the news. the streets because we talk to the streets. Come talk with us on the street 919. Looking for a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp, 1-866-398-8282. Or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. Finally, a line of baking products that caters for the gluten-free, cholesterol-free, egg-free, and dairy-free person. Enriched with sesame, flax meal, and chai seeds. Also try our line of seasonings and spices that are ideal for diabetic, kidney, heart, colon, and hypertensive persons. Perfect for the whole family. Healthy O, the healthier way to go. Find it in a supermarket near you. Hi, good day, people. This is your nutritional educator here, as you know. The whole thing is about educating people. So, you see, when you're educating, you can make better choices when coming to your health and your wellness. And this is what we're about here at Natural Solution Education. That's the first premise of a doctor. That's what it means, is to educate people so they can make better choices. Now, Today what we want to show you, we spoke about having what we call our central immune protectors and immune enhancers. This is what we're going to be sharing with you today. Right? Now, we're going to start by the oxylite. You could have mentioned this already. Now, the oxylite is your hydrogen peroxide. And like I said before, you see here people will be quite familiar with this because this is used, as you can see here on the chart, for a number of things. Now, primarily what we're using this for is to disinfect the system. This sits on the same periodic table as bleach. What do I mean? The same ability that bleach will have to kill all viruses, bacteria, um, antifungal, etc. It's the same protection we get with this, but of course the human body can handle this. Now with this, you're taking three drops three times a day. And this will release and expand oxygen in the system. And as we know, once oxygen in the system, the um, body is able to heal. The medical fraternity always knew that. The thing is, the challenge is to have oxygen stable enough in a particular area in uh, enough time to cause change. What we have is the oxylite that will do a good job in that area. There's a range of issues here. And by the way, this will protect you from a number of things, especially those of you who suffer from respiratory problems. Here we have the, what we call the liquid chlorophyll. Now chlorophyll is one of my favorites because this has the ability to cleanse and detoxify the blood. Under a microscope, guys, this looks the identical way to the human blood um, and even the platelets because the difference is this has magnesium at its base and of course your other cells have iron at its base in its core, but it's the same thing, meaning that this will be able to help to build the blood for those of you who have low blood count and issues in your blood, this is excellent for building blood and detoxifying the body. I promise you guys, if you take this for, um, for three months straight, it will deodorize your body to the point where you would experience no morning breath, you will sweat, but you will get no scent, and most importantly, as I tell persons, and they laugh sometimes, 
you will use this and you will defecate and there will be no scent. Completely deodorize the system. Uh, of course, you know about our super silver has become very, very famous. And I do have to mention about this much before people know the benefits of silver. Uh, as a matter of fact, silver is what they use before the advent of antibiotics. This is nature's antibiotic people. It will kill those bacteria, those microorganisms or pathogens, we call them, without harming the immune system. So this is big time. And this is something that every household should have. You should have this in your medicine cabinet. We talk about functional medicine here, that you can reach for this if your child scraped, they have a bruise, a cut, what have you. Um, if you take this, you take it about one tablespoon twice or three times a day, depending on the size of the individual. And this will protect you even in this time where we have viruses going around. So this is your silver, super silver. Let's talk very quickly about this minerals. Now, we refer to this as Ormus minerals. And if you go online, you will see a lot about the power of these Ormus minerals. Now, minerals are important, as we know. We take in vitamin C, we take in fruits and vegetables. But unless you have certain minerals, uh, the body will not be able to synthesize, it will not be able to metabolize and utilize vitamins the way it should be. All right? So this is important. So again, we have more minerals. And by the way, this includes essential minerals as well. Here we have, this is our little hand sanitizer, we put it in a silver gel. And once the light hits, there's a color will change, okay? And that's because it should be silver particles in here. You can use as a hand sanitizer for cuts and bruises, etc. Um, I want to share this with you in this short video, our mascara, and you guys spoke about this. We had literally thousands of testimonies with this powerful uh, product before but we, it was out of circulation. So we are so happy to have this now at the time that people need this. The benefits of muscadine is that it has over 100 antioxidants. Some of them are classified as pro and some are anthocyanins. To cut a long story short, these things have different functions in the body. Diabetes, circulation, heart disease, a variety of things you can use this for, as well as protection. So we wanna leave you now a natural solution. We'll see you in another video soon to educate you as we do all the education and drive, all right? Blessings. And this is our 7 a.m. major newscast on the street, 919 FM. In the headlines, the Attorney General says face masks are being distributed to socially displaced. Active COVID-19 cases back over 1,000 with Monday's tally. Overseas, Venezuelan government asked for volunteers to test Russian COVID-19 vaccine. And now for the details. Attorney General Faris Alwari, during the Ministry of Health's virtual me media briefing on Monday, said that the new mask-wearing legislation applies to all, including the socially displaced. This to, sorry, to this he said that face masks are being distributed to persons with difficulties in their situation and to the socially displaced. The Attorney General said that the initiative is to ensure that such persons can comply with the amendment to the Public Health Ordinance, a bill to amend the Public Health Ordinance Act to make provisions for fixed penalty notices for breaches including wearing face masks in public was passed in the Senate on Saturday. Mr. Alwari reiterated that the coronavirus has no respect for age or circumstances. In other news, on Monday, a total of 68 new positive cases of COVID-19 and was reported by the Ministry of Health with one additional related debt. August 2020 ended the rich Trinidad and Tobago having 1,029 active cases and 22 deaths. The ministry reported that of the 61 patients at the Coover Hospital, six are in the intensive care unit and nine are in the high dependency unit. And now for look at overseas news with Jason Thomas. Venezuela's President Nicolas Maduro announced on Sunday that he will be asking for volunteers to test a Russian-developed COVID-19 vaccine. The Venezuelan government said it would be willing to take part in clinical trials. Mr. Maduro said that in the coming days, government will be asking for volunteers to get vaccinated. 
On August 11th, Russia announced that it had officially registered a vaccine to fight the virus, and Russian scientists reported that early stage trials were successful. The Venezuelan government has also said that it was ready to participate in the testing of Chinese and Cuban vaccines against the virus. And that was a look at our overseas news for this morning. Thank you, Jason Thomas. And now for a look at the weather. For the period today until midnight, Trinidad and Tobago, mainly a hot and sunny day despite a few cloudy patches at times. However, there is the medium chance of the afternoon isolated thunderstorm and during the late afternoon evening, there can be an increase in cloudiness with light to moderate showers in various locations which may persist into the nighttime. Gusty winds and street flooding can be expected in areas under heavy showers or thunderstorms. The Windward Islands, mainly hot and sunny day and a mostly fair night despite the isolated showers. Leeward Islands, partly cloudy to cloudy at times with isolated showers and a chance of the isolated thunderstorm. Sea slight to moderate waves up to 2 meters in open waters, less than 1 meter in sheltered areas. It is currently 33 degrees Celsius in Piaco and 32 degrees Celsius in Crown Point. And here's a recap of our headlines. The Attorney General says face masks are being distributed to socially displaced. Active COVID-19 cases back over 1,000 with Monday's tally. Overseas. Venezuelan government to ask for volunteers to test Russian COVID-19 vaccine. You've just heard our 7 a.m. national newscast on the street at 919 FM. Stay tuned for Tobago News at 9. I am Sharon Felix. And I am Jason Thomas. Good morning. From the street. News from the street. 919FM.com. Hey, just in case you didn't know, every morning on the street, 919FM, taking Sharon and Bruce Wayne, the titans of democracy. That's the morning show. I hope you could have done blessings on my nation. So Trinidad, Tobago, and the world by extension, we back. Well, people only sending me texts. Oh, God, stop now. Nah. Oh, well, you know the man wife leave him. Oh, gosh. Everybody does get at us sometime. I just get it too. Who sent you just get it too? Hey. Hey, hey. No exception to the rule. No exception to, 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 the, to, the, to the who is who. So maybe that's why he's going mad. <laughs> And like you want to go bad on the speaker or the um, president or the, the, the senate. Hmm. Look, I'm going to take the calls there. Eh? Call her. Good morning. I'm Sharon. Call on Jenny. Okay. Sharon? Yes, Angie. Happy morning to you. Good and to everybody else. Miss Sharon, um, I think, right, and this is just me, any individual would like to do their parents proud. The only one here on the phone is okay. This is my Sunday. I fell academically and all like that. But when you look at their behavior, they would like to think, okay, yes, I did an excellent job. It, 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 my words, actions, this, this shall really do me proud. But when you have to sit, know that you nurture this child and sit and look at that behavior as a parent, you know what you're telling yourself? Boy, I didn't do a good job at all. 
and the fault might not be yours because you would have done a good job. But somewhere along the line, the little dirty ways, and all of us are sick of the little dirty ways sometimes, but you, you try to work on it. Instead of that, you're behaving like you're playing a comedy fest. This man needs no to know when to shit this man. You have no bloody behavior. Have a good day. <laughs> Thank you very much. Jenny? Hi, my name is Felix. Nice Jenny. to hear your voice again. You know, mm -hmm. when you're in there and do, especially Bruce and the rice, double whammy. Yeah, go ahead. Eh? <laughs> Bruce was there, so you hold it down. I'm going to only listen to like 1.9 or a guru, Mr. Chance, Mr. Napoon. I love you, darling. I hope Stephen inside this morning he ain't going to play nothing anyway. All right, see you all day. Miss Felix. Oh, I'm a Golden Girls. Good morning. I have a girl Golden Girls, eh? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Don't that. Yeah, that's my Felix. They bounce their head. I'll make a little monster in Alzilla. Then we realize he had to deal with a monster catcher. <laughs> But where very you soon he was where you call it? Speed. Where you call it? In Alvilla? You <laughs> start over. And then I would tell you. <laughs> 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 they bounce the head. I'll make a little monster in Alzilla. Then realize he had to deal with a monster catcher. But very soon he was brought up to speed. And he had to take heed because he annoying raw was reduced to. <laughs> Crack, monkey break it back, and a little piece of fumara. It will be continued. Miss, <laughs> 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 well, the school is open now. We know it's not the norm because I think it's teacher has to go and train. I want to ask that teacher, that male teacher who made that impassionate plea that we will suffer now and take your children and leave and all that. Will he be back out to school as normal? Mm. But when you listen to what he said, it didn't sound nice coming from a teacher who has to teach our, um, our children. You remember, he only teaching Indian children, he teaching African children, trying all of them. Mm -hmm. And he made an impassionate see that could have frightened these little children if they would have heard it. Is he going to be in front of our children teacher? I'm just asking. Mm. We need to be careful with all our hate speech. We need to be careful with our racism. Because we have little children. These little children, when they go to school, they hugging up one another, them running, them playing, them in studying India, and they ain't studying Africa, nothing. That is my friend. You know who does bring it into the children? The parents at home, when these children pass the exams for SEA, or even while they um, so standard, they start to put in their mind this differentiation between African and Indian and Chinese. And then they were friends all through kindergarten and Tanti Mill School and Tanti Brown School, and then something changed in them. They didn't change like that. It's persons like that man who was speaking to take your child out of this country and others like Al Mate and El Zilla and the rest of the little monsters. It's them that create what we are seeing happening outside there with our children. They put it in their mind and they make the children get confused because the children is about love. And you're telling a child, don't like this one because he's an Indian. A child don't understand what that means. And we confuse the children's mind. So again, as I say, Anil Zilla, Anil Zilla met the monster catcher. And she make him from a row. He had to talk in a whisper. Boy. Boy, <laughs> Kola, good morning. Well, yeah, good morning to my sister, morning. and good morning to my brother Bussain, and good and, morning to each and everyone. Andrew, why mm. are you shouting? <laughs> the acoustics in here is... I get it from my mother. <laughs> <laughs> well, please whisper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but one thing I want to say, the first thing I want to say is that they make laws, and I, I come in very serious. They make laws, and I find the Speaker of the House and the Speaker of the Senate there's just so much of talking, going to the book and show the fellas and them where they have to control themselves. You don't have to talk to them, otherwise you wouldn't have no law book. Because this is an indiscipline, eh? They don't care. And Kamala put that there. Remember, Kamala and he, his partner in China, you know? Because she went into the parliament and read out his report, like, sports, like, like, um, like, sports, report. They went to the children and read it out, so that's why she bring them back inside it. And I know, we know, it's the money that they can answer for. 
That is why I tend to upset the parliament. And that is why I'm calling on the Speaker of the House and the Speaker of the um, Parliament and the Speaker of the Senate to use the law against them and bring law and order into this country. They have the authority. That is the highest court in the land. And if you don't do it, you don't go to a magistrate court or, or a court in a judge. And then you could carry on so you know. It's a contempt of court. Contempt of court is seven days in, in, in prison. State. They take it on state one time. Use the law. I'm begging them to use the law. Because these are these other communities that aim and object you know? or like Julian John and all of them. You put them there for a purpose. And for that purpose will never be fulfilled. Have a blessed day. Thank you very much. Kola, good morning. Morning, Sean. Morning, Bruce. Morning. Morning, morning. Tall man here. Tall all right, go ahead. Well, um, Sean, Bruce. Um, it's about to last too long in the Senate, you know. Because um you know the comment has set plan with, with the things that have been going um by the internet that PLM won the last two years in government and the comment has set plan to show on the Senate and the Parliament. But if you don't allow the man to ball ah! and I talk it loud it's all that talk. But why you ball it in my ears? He <laughs> 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 will not look because they see that is not his character. Mm. His character is to be loud and stupid. And if you if you is intent to carry that intelligent discussion, he will last long because mm. he don't have that in him. He have no intelligence whatsoever. And as she says, so if it, if that is how you speak, well, we start. <laughs> Why? <laughs> this one of that boy. It's not we, oh God, we see what's going on. It's, an, it's, it's, it's come on my phone. If that is how to speak, loud, well whisper. They can talk normal. People, how these people, these people understand with their insults? Eh? I, I just wonder if these people understand what is, what is their insults. If, if, if that is how to speak, well whisper. And he didn't get it yet. Boy, he won't last long because that 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 whispering is <laughs> whispering is not in animal. He has to speak loud. He won't last long. Trust me, man. You trust me. There's a prophecy. He would not last long. I go on, Sean and Bruce. Thank you very much. <laughs> Overseas line. Overseas caller, you there? All right, we lost that person. <laughs> After we talk the little politics, I have a question to ask you all. Hmm. Caller, good morning. Good morning, Sharon. Good morning, Bruce. Happy independence. Why are you talking so loud? Good morning, Sharon. Good to see you. Whisper, please. Whisper, whisper. I got a big voice when I'm born. <laughs> but Sharon, seriously, let me, let me say something right now. You could imagine... This gentleman going to a foreign land to represent our government, our country, and have to speak to dignitaries. You could imagine the fuckers, how they would look at us. Can you imagine that, Sharon? Mm. They would say something wrong. We are animals across there. We are uncivilized. You cannot speak. You you go to the highest office. You are, you are in Parliament, and you are speaking like you are in a rum shop, like you are under the influence of some drug. It is it's only you never notice. It's only people who hide this be shouting, talking loud, loud, loud. You ever notice that? Mm. You cannot go to the Parliament and behave in such a manner. And this, this and like they don't understand where they are, who they are, what they're supposed to represent. My goodness. But I, I agree with the guy that he won't be there for long enough, but not for the reasons the gentleman now mentioned. The reason is, is, is because of the investigations that they are doing, which have implicated them in certain wrongdoings. But I, I just want people to draw to the attention of what this goodly lady has done. The insult 
that she has placed on this country by putting a person with who you fired for misbehavior in office. So they were not good then, but all of a sudden they're good enough now. Seriously, they, they, you were charged for corruption. You came and read, as the gentleman said, read out all the, 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 the um, files for the case so that when it is, there was a case, there was a prejudice against the case, so the case had to be dropped and thrown out, which was purposefully done, I would say, because if you are lady with silk, you're supposed to know that if you do that, you, you spoil the case before it is tried. And they very well know that because down to the um, Speaker of the House, Big Jack one of them, them for six, although it was a lie. But nonetheless, so they are aware of these sort of things. And you put that person back in the Parliament. That's an insult to the, to the Parliament and to the people of the country. You place a lady who it is, it, it, it is admitted racist based on the, the rantings that they had on social media. And you put them in the parliament. And then you you, you have a, a lady, I, I don't know if you listen to the parliament station, the most hypocritical person I've ever heard in my life. You come and say, I don't want to be an a, a, a obstructionist. And I, I will support anything, any bill that is going to help the people of the country. But I'm not supporting this bill. Seriously, come on, be honest. Oh, people in this country, only open your eyes, sir. These are the bunch of people you all want to represent the country that you all have elected to represent you, really? My goodness. If that is how your representation is served, uh, I'm sure all you're still hungry. Sharon, you all have a nice day. Thank you very much. Well, let me just say to you, Devon Marad says, Anil Roberts will drag down the image of the UNC. Hmm. Political activist Devon Marad said Anil Roberts' appointment as a UNC senator was another bad decision by the opposition leader. In a media statement, the former People's, Na People's Partnership Government <laughs> Minister said Roberts should have waited until the conclusion of his legal matters before resuming frontline politics. He said the appointment of the UNC six senators only served to show that despite the 2020 general elections defeat, nothing has changed in the mindset of the leadership. Senators Wade Mark, Julian John, David Nackett, Damian Lider, and uh, with that, Daranti Lachmi Dial only highlight the UNC's incapability to transform itself into a party to attract new voters. Instead, the senators appear to be a continuation by the leader to attempt to show up the disenchant disenchanted base. Maraj had added that Kamla didn't disappoint and made yet another bad decision. The population has to once again contend with the tired and apparent never-ending immoral wade mark. Oh God. And that is not me saying eh? only I'm reading an article on the um, what do you call it? Is or something? Where are we? I get confused. Right. Right. <clears throat> Said Maraj added that Kamla didn't disappoint and made yet another bad decision. The population has to once again contend with the tired and apparent never ending immoral weed mark. The baggage of life sports of Anil Roberts will only drag down image of the UNC. Robert should have waited until the conclusion of his legal matters before resuming frontline politics. He further stated that Stacey Rupnarine's ex-husband, the invisible Damien Lyde, <laughs> along with defeated candidate David Nackett, will add nothing new to bolster the image of the UNC in the Senate. Jolene John is perhaps the only ray of hope among the half dozen. According to Maharaj, the UNC House of Representatives, team taught to be the weakest in the party's history, have now been matched in its incompetence by bland and... What is that? Oh, God. Incept, incept senatorial appointments. 
These appointments, you can't see from there. These appointments only reinforce that the leadership of Kamala Prasad Bissessa is not serious about positioning the party to challenge the PNM, but merely to ensure that she continues to have a full complement of chair leaders to make Kamala great again. Maharaj dem demands UNC internal election take place this year. Devon Maharaj is not letting up. The UNC activist has been uh, um, calling for Kamala Prasad Bissessa to resign and has now released a statement, and that was a winner. That was a story before. Kamla defends appointment of Anil Roberts. Mama, yo. Instead of people study to bus mark on other people, go and find out what's going on in your party. Hmm. <laughs> Anil Roberts was not guilty of criminal activity regarding life sports. Where she answered back, you know. That's the word of opposition leader Kamala Prasad Bissessa as she defended her decision to appoint Roberts as a senator. Yes. Devon Maraj, you must understand. You, of all people, must understand. As Senator De Bruce, mm. make noise and disrupt everything. <laughs> Bruce, when you go there, take two pull. Take two drink and sit down. But this is the surface I could talk. My mother make me so. I tell you, you know. And ever so often, when the thing, they go chuck him with a pin under the seat. And he go jump, ah! What? He speak of Alaskan. So the acoustics in here is very good. We can hear you have to shout. And then she will tell him, Please whisper you say, but President, my name is Arnold Roberts. Hmm. And I'm here to this the Senate. Put me out if you want. Good morning, Mr. Chats. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, Bruce Wayne. Good morning, morning, Mr. Charles. Good morning, morning, Titans of Democracy at Home and Abroad in Tobago, Jenny, Mother Tunapuna, all the Carols, everybody, everybody. Morning, oh, Mr. Chance. Morning, morning, morning. That, oh, so sweet. But let me, first of all, I hope that you enjoyed your Independence Day yesterday. My Independence I had... Day, I was all over I La Brea, I've, been advised, I've, been advised, <laughs> I've been already advised. And I want to say to you, take my hat off to you again. Perhaps somebody will know sometime, but I want to give you all the credit. And perhaps on Thursday, I will share with you how you would have been seen if you were in a place called China. Okay. I will let you know what will be your credit score. Right? But on, 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 our, on, on Thursday, when we're speaking on our own. Yes. But I want to identify today again, as I did the last on the last occasion, when I spoke about the Speaker of the House, Judith and he said, George, and I talked about leadership. That's the issue here, you know, people. And that's a big issue in Trinidad and Tobago as we go forward. Leadership. Here again, we have another example of sound leadership. <laughs> the president of the Senate, Ms. Christine Kangaloo. And she was very clear what is supposed to happen, what is the conduct and decorum that is desired in the Senate. And I'll tell you something. The person who set the tone for how we behave in the country is the Prime Minister. Let me quote what he said. No one in my cabinet will be allowed to fall asleep. Conduct and performance. Are you hearing Felix? Not only performance, but your conduct will be appraised on an ongoing basis. What you hear from the UNC, performance beat will talk all the time. But it's not only performance, it's how quality of your performance and that is why my prime minister said conduct and performance will be um, appraised on an ongoing basis but that president of the senate she made it clear that disrespectful empty vessels will not be allowed in the senate see she made it very clear that disrespectful empty vessels will not be allowed in the senate you will not only have to whisper but you have to whisper on something that is relevant. Not only with final, but speak on the bill. But let me close by telling you,
this lady, the last time I pointed out who is Miss Anis, Bridget Anissa George, I know a lot of us know it, but there are many of us who wouldn't know. This lady, Miss Christine Kangaloo, who is president of the Senate, is an attorney at law. She's a very experienced person in parliamentary matters. So she's not just cop, she's not a neophyte. She's an attorney at law. She served as an opposition senator under Mr. Manning. She served in the minister of the, the she served in the office of the prime minister. She was the minister of legal affairs. She was minister of science tertiary, and tertiary education. She served as vice president of the Senate, and now she's president. And let me hear, let me tell you this: she's the only person in Trinidad and Tobago to have served as vice president and president of the Senate. You hear me? She's the only one, a very experienced person, a leader of quality. And that is a demonstration that you, you have seen there, my people. All of you remember that in the country, whether it's in the home, whether it's in the organization, wherever you are, leadership sets the tone for the conduct. In your home, the parents, the leadership sets the tone. In the community, in any organization, the leadership, the quality of the leadership sets the tone. And that prime minister of ours set the tone for what is going to be in China to be good. But he says, conduct, not only performance, conduct and performance will be appraised on an ongoing basis. Thank you very much, Ms. Felix, for the time, and Bruce Wayne as well. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Chance. <coughs> oh, you're, you're most welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Sharon, <laughs> raise my volume, please. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> tell everybody about loud and quiet and unfortunately I don't need your help. Oh. Good morning, Trinidad Tobago. <laughs> Happy Independence. 58 years. Well, only bring me back some sesame issue days, boy. Only, <laughs> but only have, only, but, but I, you know, we, we, we must, we must congratulate the president of the Senate. Huh? She said, whisper. Whisper. <laughs> oh, oh, Mr. Chan said just now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but, but, but look, all you believe oh, the man who say blame him more than the father for his big mouth. All you, <laughs> that what the man said, Parliament, and I didn't say it at all. But then you have to whisper. <laughs> hmm? oh, God, I want to cry. And, <laughs> and Mr. Roberts, you're in another house. <laughs> <laughs> She said, she said, you're not in the lower house, you're in the upper house. Oh, God. Yeah. And, I am the, and I am the presiding officer. Hmm. All, you, all, 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 all you listen to this now. All you listen to this. Listen to me. Trinidad Tobago, you listen to the independent message by the opposition leader. Hmm. Huh? When she talk about who getting rich and who getting poor. She of all persons should be ashamed. To say who gained with channel gain power. Mm, 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 mm. We thought her message would have be hope, some hope to work with the government and we will fight the, the, the COVID 19 together. And we will make Trinidad a better place and we will deal with the with the with, with the racial um outbreak right now in Trinidad and Tobago. We will bring back the people together as one, as Trinidadian and Tobagonian. We didn't get us some opposition leader. That's why I'm saying to Trinidad Tobago this morning, thank God 
You have to thank God on the 50th anniversary of Trinidad and Tobago. 58 years as an independent state from 1962 to now. We have to thank God. You know why? God has put the right people in charge of our economy for the next five years. God has shown Trinidad and Tobago that I am boss. Right? And those who feel they are boss, I will teach them a lesson. Mm -mm. And God has rejected them outright. Trinidad and Tobago, we should praise God. We should get on our knees and have a day of prayer and thanks. You know why? To thank God for saving me from Anil Robert, so that I be the minister of sports again. Mm. To thank God for saving us for Nafisa Momo, that be the speaker of the House of Representatives. Oh, good, Wendell. Listen, huh? listen. The ads coming up, but you're not being going. Listen. Uh, uh, hold it that on. That was so embarrassing. Yes, I'm uh, holding on. That is what it, that is what it make you campaign with them for? That kind of embarrassment? You yeah, must and, and, know that and, 22 uh, cannot go into 19. And, and on top of the scene called for recount. <laughs> scene called for recount. What I is say, wrong with these people? I say she that called for recount, but I have to tell you not to be why we have to thank God. Hmm. We have to thank God. We have to get on our knees eh? and thank God so that Anil Ram would have been the Minister of Finance. Oh, God. Hmm. To pay God. This is serious business, you know. We have to thank God. Thank God that the AG will not have been Anil Ram Logan. Oh, that we return. Hmm. And thank God, Kamala Prasad, which is as Prime Minister, right, would have bring an a bill in Parliament to trigger off Section 137. To remove the, the um, Chief Justice. Chief Justice, and thank God, she will never, we have to thank God Wendell, so that she will not, yes. Wendell, hold on, thank God, yeah. it adds coming, hold on. Okay, that's all right. They talk, you talk, come talk with us. On the street, 919 FM. We know the street because we talk to the street. Come talk with us on the street, 919 FM. I don't understand that, you know, Bruce. Hmm. When they'll finish up quickly, where you? Yeah, you hear that? Mm-hmm. Thank God we will not see justice mark the passade as the as the new chief um judge as the new chief justice of Trinidad and Tobago. We have to thank God. You know, God destroy her whole plan. Thank God we will not see Leroy Hunt as Minister of National Security. Thank God we will not see the, the what the former deputy commissioner of police name? The, 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 the fellow with the land. With the land deal and all kind of shoppiness. Thank God we will not see him as the commissioner of police. You know, man, we have so much thing to thank God for. Eh? We have so much thing to thank God that we would have seen Mohip as the minister of education. We have so much thing to thank God for, boy. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago, let's get on all your knees, put all your hand up in the air, right? And praise God and say, God is a living God. Thank God we will not see a head of National Security Council again as Kamala Prasad is stand on a blind eye to massive corruption, massive fraud. Huh? Thank God he protect the Treasury. Thank God. And Wendell? Wendell? Yes, I'm listening to you. I have to thank God right now. I have to go and play Tobago Heritage. Well, okay, though. Thank God for that, too. <laughs> <laughs> So people, we will be going to the Tobago Heritage mm -hmm. um, Festival 2020 is here and it's online. Be sure to tune in to the Heritage Radio Drama Series every week until September 11th. This week features a young love story that didn't quite work out quite. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was last week. Oh, so, oh Lord, Lord, they gave me the wrong thing. Yes, so, Lord, so we're going to it now. All right, guys. Okay, <laughs> let me hush my mouth. Shut up, Sharon. Whisper. Sorry about that. <laughs> Hey, just in case you didn't know, every morning on the street, 919 FM, taking Sharon and Bruce Wayne, the titans, titans. of democracy. That's the morning show. show. show.
are now tuned into yesteryear's courtening a mount Glen production on the tobago festivals network Me go to church this morning, and me not too like this office, you know. Me not feel it at all, at all. But what wrong with you? When the man preach good, the man preach real good. But, eh, eh. Anyway, bring Sunday, give me for now. Me no see make you not feel this office. Your stomach in empty. You ain't a study for come near the ninny and we cook the house, yeah? But, eh, eh. Anyway, eh, tell you. Has me no come home yet? Hmm. My watch and a play me now, see? Me always a notice how she and Mark always a hunu hunu. Man, you does a jump to confusion too quick. I must be church story where they might talk about. Church story? Hmm. When you think about her, you can't be loud. Ethel, no for want a tongue make cackle can't talk. You must watch and learn to read between the lines. Oh, Mac, bruh, how oh, are you meet him so early? I you left before service done? No, no, not at all. When church over, we leave. Church over. Eh, I find how you meet him only. Where about Caddy? Caddy lay down inside. Oh, oh. Ah, that make me pass S, me and Mark a pad down there. But I tell, not treat that light, you know. Because my ears are gimme one Tory. Not because you go to church with them. Careful with the family there. From granddaddy right down to uncle, nephew. All of them character rotten, rotten. That family they no good at all. Belize, I will make you as a thing so low about people. Me sure of some church story where them are put together. For Sunday school later. Hey, you son no, no see where me a see. And me no tell you half of where me hear. That boy there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And you know me really like the boy. I only a matter of time before me tell you daddy. Before we go talk to your parents. But Belize, I way do. For Heaven's sake, Belize. Tell me no. Tell me something. Talk to me. Ma, I reach home. Yes, me. Yes, ma. I don't like this kind of behavior, you know. Look how long are we meet home. How have you been there? Ma, who have you been talk to? I'm going to make you just talk to me so rough. Be sure that Belize in there up here, you know. Wait. What make you ask me something like that now? Because she passed me down a road I come up this side. And she really watched me a kind of way, you know. Yes, me particular. Particular place here. Yeah. Yes, me beware. They are run, but night I go catch them. Ethel? Ethel? In a me deep sleep. Me day, and I hear your voice. What happened to you? As me oil, I only hope 
And now you, we are provoke you, mama, that is one the morning. Pa, me not do nothing. Me not know if me come home from church with a demon, but all of a sudden she start for a cup. All right, Esme, not a next word. Mama. Not a next word from you, or else me let you swallow all them teeth in your mouth there. Tell howdy, howdy. How are you do? Well, girl, praise God for life. Are we not too bad at all? Eh, eh. Like you are go a road? No, no. I'm go down a road, but not for stop. I'll come back soon. Oh, okay, boy. Tirilla, where you have to know? Can me just uh, come from by tear tell them there. But she says she go along a road, bo. Oh, well, me just walk up a road just in case anything happen where me no know that me should know or anything for me to see. Eh, eh. Please, you are something else now. But here you now, me see a nice, good-looking boy. Does a pass down here sometimes? A four generation them. So you no know the boy there. He been God in America, so he now come back home to live. So you know see how he groom up and look good? Me hear he well fortify himself. He bring back everything for put a house. All he want now are the woman. Eh, eh. That's our good boy for Ethel the daughter, you know. She gonna make a good wife. Eh, I know you got daughter. Why you not try hook them up? Because he was a much better man than that boy, Mark. Where does that hang wrong, hang wrong? Anyhow, I expect somebody come by me, but any time now. So I'm gone. Me want to go up a road, you know. But Mark, Mum and Daddy, them does always there in front of the yard. And me, me feel me a turn back. This episode was brought to you by the Tobago Festivals Commission Limited and sponsored by the Tobago House of Assembly. Yo, Yo. this is your boy Ziggy Rankin and right now you're listening to the Titans of Democracy. You don't know. Real talk. talk. All right, so we are back. Yes. Mm-hmm. That is back now. Trinidad and Tobago, while you have to whisper now, you can't talk loud. Whisper. Somebody said it before we went to the heritage segment that he wouldn't last too long. But Trinidad and Tobago, so be it. What what we gonna do for that? We can't do nothing. That is the choice. So, guys, we're going back and take your calls because I have a question to ask here today. I want to hear all your honest opinion. <laughs> Call her good morning. <laughs> Grandy. Hello. Hey, Sharon. Morning. Good morning. Good morning, Bruce. Morning, morning. I've seen all your master, boy. All in, all in playing that. Boy, not all Nina. All in <laughs> right. And, uh, and like I really, I really, keep, I really keep on the mask because we sanitized before we came in, and the right. thing does make me sneeze. Yeah. So, so I'm saying, morning to, fighter. Yeah, morning to Mr. Trans and Teresa Cornlef, Mami Sauce, all the sources, Miss Cummins. As uh, I just want to call the wish, Tasky, a special, special happy birthday today. He's a very hard worker for the PNM charity. When he when he hear election call, he out there picking up people, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. Yes, so I had a call this morning to wish him a happy, happy, happy birthday. Of course, Pierre's like to see many, many more. And Sharon, yeah. I ain't, I ain't fighting with our position, no, because them doom them doom their own self. That is all I have to say. They they, they, mm. 
they, they're thing in their own self, Sharon. So have a good day, right? All well, take care. Thank you very much. Let me say good morning to Nicole Polonair Henry. You know, long I say good morning to Auntie June, that is Polly's family, his wife, daughter, sons, and grand grandchildren. Good morning to all of you, darling. Love you so much. I kind of lost track because we're so busy. Eh? What are they ashamed? Paula, good morning. Good morning, Sharon. Good morning, 1285. Good morning to Boosie. Morning, morning. I want to say happy birthday to my son in law, Sean Thomas, this morning. Sharon, and when I hear all the good things that you did over for the past two days, I want to just say this to you. I wonder what God was thinking when he created you. I wonder if he knew everything about me because he made our dreams come true. When God made you, he must have been thinking about we this is from the titles all the trials you go to to help us so can i say my morning oh. of course good morning mr malcolm miss Gemma, miss angie miss thomas manu maura uh, miss gloria miss mother tonapuna you know i love you eh so i know everything is going good with you because he's a praying warrior Jenny, Mr. Chan, and our special friend, the visually impaired, Ms. Monica Paul, Ms. Diane Smith. So all you be safe, we turn safe, and safe to all your family. Be careful. I love down and listen. Sharon, what happened to you? You crying, huh? No, 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 no. Well, you know, as they say, I don't whisper, you know, when I to say Sharon, because my mother then put my mouth in the in the pool and paint and it bleached the bleaches, so I can't show. <laughs> but I, <laughs> I know I was to make you laugh. I'm gone. <laughs> well, I need to stop it right now. Eh? But in all, while I might be making joke and laughing, in all seriousness, we have to be a little more disciplined in our country. Call her. Good morning. God bless you, Miss Sharon. Brucey. Good morning. Morning. I just said morning, 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 morning. Thank you, Jesus. And Miss Sharon, I have to run. So what I want to tell you, keep up with good work. Brucey. Good darling. Anything for me now going up the road and on a mission today. All right. You see what I tell you, right? I will check it. I ain't checked my phone yet. Right, Miss Sharon. God bless you, my dear. Keep up the good. I spoke to Angie. So you have a blessed day. I'm running out from the house till later. If I get the link, I go listen to all the right. So have a blessed day, love all the blessing, blessing. Jan Jan morning. Everybody, love, love, love is the answer. So every time. Morning. Bye bye. Thank you very much. So in all seriousness, we have to be a disciplined nation and a disciplined bunch of people in society. And if we're not doing that, bet your bottom dollar, you ain't go get it in return. Hmm. And you know, let me tell you, like this morning I come into Wooks so Park on a particular street. Mm. There's a security firm on that particular street. And every morning, sometimes I want to stop me car and say something. They must know by now, all your double parking in the road, so I and my vehicle big. So I had to take my time to pass. Now, one now, he is he, he reversing, right? But he reversing with everything outside. And I, so I stop, and he telling me, come, come, come. So I say, my brother, man, when you park properly, I will pass. So after and I tell them, I say, you, of all people, you ought to know the rules and regulation. He tell me, go on with your car. I stop, I say, you know, you know who I am? You know if I'm the commissioner, police, wife, daughter, sister, friend? You know if I'm the president? You know, you know, you don't know, sometimes people have to be careful. Mm -hmm. And you're done doing something wrong, and you want to... And then he stopped and he, he just kind of watching me. They're double parking every morning. Every morning. You're fighting your way to pass. 
And then if you touch the car, you know, that's another story. Call her. Good morning. Good morning, Sharon. Good, good, mo good morning, morning. Anne-Marie. Uh, uh, am, I, am I loud enough? Yes, Anne-Marie. <laughs> hey, well, yeah, I've been laughing this morning. Yeah. Good morning, Sharon. Good morning, Lucy. Good morning. Sharon. <laughs> Dudu. Let me say good morning to my sisters, uh, all the Titans, Warriors, and um, anybody else who hear my voice this morning. Sharon Gill, this morning I got so annoyed. I went out to take my garbage outside. What could face me? A lady passing there, I want to believe she's a caregiver, okay? But her child must be about six years old. No mask on her face, no mask on the child's face. So I was wondering whether she didn't listen to the Attorney General. Somehow I said, I'm really not to wish anything, but a police vehicle should have just swing up the road and pick up she and the child and carry them in the station. Because I find for big people, the, 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 the two, I know, two ingenious. Come on, the man. The man plead. Plead with us to put our masks on. It started from Monday. Let me Monday tell you, Monday. yesterday we were in San Fernando going to Labri, passing by Gulf City Girl and a police vehicle. I didn't have on the mask. I just take it off to take a little breather and I was drinking some water. Mm -hmm. I just about to put it back on and he stopped. Ma'am, I said, officer, I know where you stopped me for, eh? But I know now take it up. He said, put it back on now, please, I'm begging you. It's for your it's safety, my safety, and everybody else. I exactly. said, okay, officer. I said, but I was putting it back on. I say, see, on me neck, I just take it down to drink the water to put it back up. I say, see me, Sharon, I did put on my thing and I'll be gone. Why you have to be speaking to big people like that? Hmm. Anyway, Sharon, let me just take this opportunity to wish one of my classmates at the Tunapuna RLC school. I want to wish uh, Patricia Otten. She lives in Valencia. Today is her birthday, so I want to wish her all God's blessings. That's my darling friend. We've grown up together and all that, so Pat, have a great day, honey, and stay safe. Thank you very so much. Everybody else, have a great day. Okay, love. We bye have bye. to go to the ads at this time, guys. Don't you feel When we come back, I have a question to ask. Mm -hmm. And I want an honest, honest, honest answer from both men and women. Yo, 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 this is a big mic, not the mass man. Looking for a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp 1-868-398-8282 or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. Finally, a line of baking products that caters for the gluten-free, cholesterol-free, egg-free, and dairy-free person. Enriched with sesame, flax meal, and chai seeds. Also try our line of seasonings and spices that are ideal for diabetic, kidney, heart, colon, and hypertensive persons. Perfect for the whole family. Healthy O, the healthier way to go. Find it in a supermarket near you. Hi, good day, people. This is your nutritional educator here, as you know. We go together about educating people. So, you see, when you're educated, you can make better choices when coming to your health and your wellness. And this is what we're about here at Natural Solution Education. That's the first premise of a doctor. That's what it means is to educate people so they can make better choices. Now, Today what we want to show you, we spoke about having what we call our central immune protectors and immune enhancers. This is what we're going to be sharing with you today. Right? Now, we're going to start by the Oxylife. You could have mentioned this already. Now, the Oxylife is your hydrogen peroxide. And like I said before, the senior people will be quite familiar with this because this is used, as you can see here on the chart, for a number of things. Now, primarily what we're using this for is to disinfect the system. This sits on the same periodic table as bleach. What do I mean? The same ability that bleach will have to kill 
all viruses, bacteria, um, antifungal, etc. is the same protection I get with this, but of course the human body can handle this. Now with this, you're taking three drops, three times a day, and this will release and expand oxygen in your system. And as we know, once oxygen in the system, um, body is able to heal. The medical fraternity always knew that. The thing is, the challenge is to have oxygen stable enough in a particular area in uh, enough time to cause change. What we have is the oxylite that will do a good job in that area. And it's a range of issues here. And by the way, this will protect you from a number of things, especially those of you suffering respiratory problems. Here we have the, what we call the liquid chlorophyll. Now chlorophyll is one of my favorites because this has the ability to cleanse and detoxify the blood. Under microscope, guys, this looks the identical way to the human blood um, and even the platelets because the difference is this has magnesium at its base and of course your other cells have iron at its base and its core, but it's the same thing, meaning that this will be able to help to build the blood. For those of you who have low blood count and issues in blood, this is excellent for building blood and detoxifying the body. I promise you guys, if you take this for, um, for three months straight, it will deodorize your body to the point where you would experience no morning breath, you will sweat but you will get no scent, and most importantly, as I tell persons, and they laugh sometimes, you will use this and you will defecate and there will be no scent. Completely deodorize the system. Uh, of course, you know about our super silver has become very, very famous. And I do have to mention about this much before people know the benefits of silver. Uh, as a matter of fact, silver is what they use before the advent of antibiotics. This is nature's antibiotic people. It will kill those bacteria, those microorganisms or pathogens we call them, without harming the immune system. So this is big time. And this is something that every household should have. You should have this in your medicine cabinet. We talk about functional medicine here. Yeah that you can reach for this if your child is scraped, they have a bruise, a cut, what have you. Um, if you take this, you take it about one tablespoon twice or three times a day, depending on the size of the individual, and this will protect you even in this time where we have viruses going around. So this is your silver, super silver. Let's talk very quickly about this minerals. Now, we refer to this as almost minerals, and if you go online, you will see a lot about the power of these almost minerals. Now, minerals are important as we know. We take in vitamin C, we take in fruits and vegetables, but unless you have certain minerals, uh, the body will not be able to synthesize, it will not be able to metabolize and utilize vitamins the way it should be. All right? So this is important. So again, we have more minerals, and by the way, this includes essential minerals as well. Here we have, this is our little hand sanitizer, it put into a silver gel. And once the light hits this, the color will change, okay? And that's because it should be silver particles in here. You can use as a hand sanitizer for cuts and bruises, etc. Um, I want to share this with you in this short video. Our muscular engineer spoke about this. We had literally thousands of testimonies with this powerful uh, product before, but we it was out of circulation. So we are so happy to have this now at the time that people need this. The benefits of muscadine is that it has over 100 antioxidants. Some of them are classified as proanthocyanins and some are anthocyanins. To cut a long story short, these things have different functions in the body. Diabetes, circulation, heart disease, a variety of things you can use this for, as well as protection. So we want to leave you now a natural solution. We'll see you in another video soon to educate you as we do our education and drive. Alright? Blessings. I just can't trust them and I like ice them frozen, like ice them frozen. Be careful of the friends you keep. Then I have no mercy, then I have no mercy. Be careful of the friends you keep. You pull them up, they push you down, sink the ship and let you drown. When them done, them run left you. And leave you standing like Daniel in a lion's day. Same vine, say we no want the 
them to dance around we. We looking at we face and deny we. I feel what we back when them around we. Them a wolf in sheep loading around we. Them smile in your face, them a snake in the grass. Always a want the mass. Always a want the mass. Who no give me pass? Yeah, yeah. Beat of the night, yeah. Have to sit and break bread. So how can I just man when we come from the same vine? Beat of the night, yeah. Have to sit and break bread. So how can I just man when we come from the same vine? Them frozen, be careful of the friends you keep. Then I have no mercy, then I have no mercy. Be careful of the friends you keep. You pull them up, then push you down, sink the ship and let you drown. When them done, them run left you. And leave you standing like Daniel in a lion stay. Peter the night job. Have to sit and break bread. So how can I just mind? We face and deny we I feel what we back when them around we Them a wolf in sheep loading around we Them smile in your face, them a snake in the grass Always a van de mass Always a van de mass Who no give me pass, yeah, yeah Beat of the night, yeah After sit and break bread So how can I just mind? But I have a question to ask this morning. I want an honest, honest answer and an honest opinion. Where are all my live persons? Where are they going? Hello? That, 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 that song sent people to town. What jail is this I see in here? <laughs> all you come back here? Where are they going? Come on, come on, all you come back on the live and share the live. I have a question, a serious question. Ladies or gentlemen, if you catch your husband or wife with another man or woman on your bed, and the man or woman gives you a check of $15 million, are you going to collect? Are you collecting you, your husband, or are you going to collect the check? I reserve my comments for last. So you come home from work or anywhere or you decide to make a tag back and you catch your husband or your wife on your marital bed or your bed you're living in better come law, however or you even let me go further you, 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 if you catch your man or your woman with a next man or a woman whether it's in a whether it be in a hotel wherever wherever and they decide, the woman or the man decides to say, hey, what? Take this check of $15 million and give you a chance now. Are you going to collect the check or you want your husband or your wife back? The lines are yes, open. Miss. Three four two zero zero eight one. Yes, miss, I am here. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mrs. Rowley, you can answer that question. Man, I take the money because they must still carry on their affair. Mm-hmm. So I will take my million dollar mm-hmm. because they're still going to carry on their affair anyhow. Mm-hmm. You understand? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I take in my money because they're still carrying on their affair. Excellent. <laughs> What's going on? You know that we, we have no... Um, I hear we that. have no, we're not to, getting you on the radio in Tobago. Okay. I get in you on the television, but then getting you no radio, nothing. That's why Tobago people not calling. Oh, Lord. Well, I know what since to yesterday, do. Since yesterday, we're not getting you all on morning. I don't know what to say again. Oh, I know. Yes, so you and I going to take, I going to take my money. And make myself happy because they're going, still going and make themselves happy. Sure. All right? Okay, darling. You can't stop it. Well, wherever it is, so it's got to be. All right? So give me my money. <laughs> Bye-bye. Thank you, love. <laughs> Have a ah. good day. Morning to everybody. Love all you. <laughs> all right. Turn up the mic. Come on, guys, where everybody gone? Only answer the question, man. Caller, good morning. Good morning, Sharon. Yes, morning. So, Sharon, this, this, the man, new name is Alan Elmo Robert. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Man, ask a question. Answer my question, please. Sorry, I'm, 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 answer the question. <laughs> Sorry, I was, I was not wrong. You wasn't wrong for the question? No, no, no. I, All I, right. I thought I All uh, right. Well, let me take somebody who was wrong to answer. Uh, <laughs> you studied who is Elmo? <laughs> Paula? Hello. Good morning. Morning. Yes, son. The question is yes, because otherwise he's going back to take the money. <laughs> <laughs> so you're wiser than you? He going back right there, so I will take the money and do something with it. Thank you very yeah? much. Thank you. All right, then. Have a nice day. All right. Okay. Overseas line caller, good morning. Whispering hope, oh, welcome that voice. Whisper, we are the whisper. I'm too up when I have to whisper. <laughs> are you hearing me? Yes. You hearing me? Yes, ma'am. Are you hearing me? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> you know <laughs> Hey, good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning. I'm taking even less than 500 million. <laughs> I'll take house and all. Because these men and them, they work place. And we don't know how long he been, she been going in there. Mm. You understand? Even though they say money cannot buy love. But I to show you a woman that's living a different way than a man. A woman that think 10 times, 20 times, 30 times before she ever think of bringing a, 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 a man in the marital home. But the man and them, they are not shame, I don't care what. You understand? So that's the worst that might. Mr. Napuna? Hello? What happened to you? <laughs> Mr. Napuna? Hey, hey. She did be lost connection. She called on the overseas line. Uh-huh. I know what happened there. Sorry, Mr. Napuna, but not my fault. Something that's con- disconnected. Call her. Good morning. Good morning, sweetie pie and Lucy. Hi, Maria Lyons. I'm taking the money. Yes, Mano. Morning, morning, Bruce again. Uh, well, Bruce, oui. after the next, let me tell you something. Give me the money and do what you want. It ever comes so it's very silly, pussy, and we only cash to me. I love you, baby, but that carry me hungry. This starvation got to finish just like that. But you got to sell me, pussy, sell me, pussy. Can Bruce look that and pay for me, go see. Give me the money, yes, and you go out your business, yes, darling. Thank you very much, Manu. <laughs> Overseas caller, you there? I know what to stop with start to whisper, you know. What happened? Manu always started talking too loud. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm telling you, these men and them, you don't know. 
Now it's 8.15 a.m. And let me give you my, my, um, my piece, all right? So, Trinidad and Tobago, while I am taking the money for sure, I have to make sure that the check is bounce, like somebody talking, I say, mm, they're they, they reading my mind, that the check doesn't bounce, and uh, when you give me that 15 million is a down payment, so I want my next 15. So what you're supposed to do for me, in essence, is to transfer my money while I transfer it one time to my account. And you can have the house, the bed, the man, and everything. I'm giving you, I'm selling you, giving you the whole package. Take it and go with it. Transfer my money and throw your waste. And throw your waste. Uh-huh. But let me get my money one time. Yeah. So don't give me no part here and then part tomorrow. You don't have because you're going and sample or you must be sampling the goods all the time. Yeah. But now you come home to sample it in my eye. Yeah. I have no problem. Long time I would have eat up myself and I want to fight and this and that. Not this time. I wish you luck. Give me my 15 million by two. Or give me the 15 million, transfer it straight to my account one time. And you can have the whole package. A bit strong, but... Caller, good morning. Good morning. Is that the business of the inner jilla? Excuse me? <laughs> okay, ma'am. Have a blessed day. Um, he's shouting. You heard what he said? He's shouting. Catch up with him. He ain't winning no. 
He is shouting. Always stay there. Everybody does get at at some point in time. Everybody. If it have a good man or woman in this world who never do that and don't do that, or they call me now. I leave in while doing and going and see. Call her. Hey, Bruce. Yes, man. Bruce. Hey. Look for the culture, boy. Sell the boy. Look for it now, boy. Mano. <laughs> Mano. Yes, Check yes, your yes. phone. I will send it for you. I ain't here, ain't nobody. Uh, so guys, all the calls we getting on that. Uh, all, they don't, all they don't want to tell me, all they're afraid to talk. Like all they're afraid of your husband or wife here, all you. Yes, village. The village will live so I ain't got to meet some regular talk back. You can be proper to them. You can be proper to Village. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's it. Could you report on yesterday's activity, please, as you're on the line? <laughs> my Felix, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Check my it, friend tell me, my friend tell me, no check, cash only. <laughs> and wait, is, wait, is he saying about loves, yeah? Hey, 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 don't put that on my phone. Right. <laughs> Why? Yeah, my Felix, yesterday, I was very impressed. Because, you know, for sometimes the first appearance, you know, is really matter a lot and I was very impressed to see the young man and the way how we had the train and them I I couldn't believe it's a man with taking care of them train with Felix. I've been honest. The man have the train well taken care of the well dressed the neat and everything and he was very humble and I've been happy to know that he I've hearing people saying that he have a anger management problem I think but we see no signs of that. Because he was very humble and he was very poor. Like, I don't know if it was just a false impression, but to what I saw yesterday, it ain't nothing like what I hear people say. And I really sit down and I talk to him and I tell him, I say, well, a man just had a breakdown before he built back up. And so just take it at the breaking down stage. And, and he was very humble. And go talk about which part is famous, Felix. Lord of mercy, I feel like I can move out one time and sing it and live there because the place is real clean and nice. I cannot feel the system alive. Hello? Is that calling with you? All right, yeah. Yes, yeah, so what I'm saying, all I want him to do is just humble himself and be more polite as how he is here now because he sit down and he listen to everything he has to say. And we really kind of break with you when a CTS come to you after we speak to him. I say, but how does saying this man have a ignorant attitude? I don't man have to break a cry, you know, Mr. Felix. And I see the man full, I full of water. I was very thin, so I just tread on like ground. But what I'm saying too, we really need to really keep a check on him to make sure that everything is all right and to prove everybody what they're saying is wrong. But Mr. Felix, one thing I want to say before I go, somehow I feel a strange mother has some kind of connection with people and try to make bad for that young man. This is what I pick up. All right, thank you very much, Village. Okay. Thank you, thank you very much. And also to Angie. Well, I have... Kevin? A pleasant good morning, ma'am. How are you this morning? You didn't much... Let me say bless and highly favored. Mm. How was... How, 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 how did you sleep last night? Well... Sleep like a baby. I must check my kids and sleep like newborn. Oh, Lord. When I, when I really catch myself, first of all, and foremost, I must say present good morning to everybody. I must say a heartfelt appreciation and thanks to you, Mr. Village, Ms. Angie, the gentleman that, and his wife, his whole family, I would have called his name on the air. Mm-hmm. I know it's a big risk to take him because of the negativity that has been spread out there about him. And yet still he looked into his heart and still giving me a chance to prove myself. I have to say thank you very, very, very much to him, his family. I appreciate everything. And while the iron heart, I write to beat it and show people that what I was saying, that is not me. I ready for employment. Right. I ready to start a work. 
Excellent. And of course, we had a long discussion, you and I. Not 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 completed, but we're talking. Yeah, it's not completed as yet. Right. And as I tell you, you are responsible for yourself and you are responsible for your children. You're also responsible for the way people will treat you. Exactly. You admit it to us that you have an anger problem, an issue with your... You have a problem like everybody else. And I would have told you last night, I heard some things that were not... Some negative. Some yeah. negative things that could have said, said to me, oh, God, Sharon, you're taking a chance. But, as I told you, I am giving you the benefit of the doubt. You know why? I would George take a, took a chance with me to put me on the radio. Right. How much years ago, Bruce? Eight years ago. About eight or nine years ago, right? I knew nothing about radio. I was a caller on the radio. And he took okay. a drastic chance with me to put me here in front of this mic. You know if I would have cuss, if what I would have do, how would I do it? Right. And I stand up and I prove everybody who would have been listening and waiting for me to fall flat on my face to prove them wrong. Today, my listenership is so wide. It is all over the world. You hear what I'm saying? The program I have, it's an NGO. And we have been helping people all over the place. So you are just one of them. So I am just, as I said to you, you are responsible for whatever takes place with you after today. Right. You realize where you are. You realize the kind of people you are, are, are wrong. That's and fun. use that as a stepping stone and use these people as mentors to make you a better person. You're not perfect. We all have attitude. I have a stink attitude when I'm ready. I, I, I just want to cut your thoughts. Mm -hmm. It is a say. You are not perfect. You are born perfect, but sin has made that same perfect. Well, all of that. Right. All of that. Well, I was say, when I talked to you last night, and they asked me, what if it, what if was my next move? I let you know up front. I ready to work. Excellent. I want to I want to start to work as soon as possible. But have a lot of a lot of people, including myself. I want to prove a lot of people wrong because the, missing, the misconception of me that yes, the rumors that are being spread, that is not me. That is not me. And I want to show them that that is not me. And the only way I can do that is to go and get gainful employment, do more counseling, follow through everything what I said, make it a reality, and from there everybody will see that what they were saying is not true. I don't have to open my mouth, I don't have to talk to social media, I don't have to do nothing negative, I don't have to say nothing negative, I don't have to do no life. I just have to leave everything up in the hands of the father, get an honest job, start to work, and everything will fall in place from there. All right, my dear. So we will talk later. No problem. All right. So you Thanks have a good much. day. Same to you, same to you. All right, my dear. Thanks very much. There's no love. in this life we live senseless killings all right so trinidad and tobago you heard it you heard it all right truth sunrise and i want to say to you there are persons outside of trinidad and tobago who have spoken to me in order they said they want to send a monthly help to help the gentleman and we put in that in place until he gets his foot in and um, make sure that everything is done, up, you know, according. And the person where he is is somebody that I have a lot of respect for and that I know. And when I went to the place, I say, my gosh, guys, it's furnished with everything. No, 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 can take him in. You know, so hold on for me. Right. Needles? Felix, good morning. Morning. Good 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 morning.
phone in put, the put, put, your phone, put your phone on loudspeaker so we can hear you a little harder. All right, hold on. Yeah. Can you hear me now? Not so much. No, I don't know. Your phone real low, boy. I had to tell you my phone given a little problem. So. All right, like I had to buy a phone for you? Nah, I ain't going to need that. I'm going to need <laughs> I go in and buy a me too. Like the next phone I go in and buy. It's your left hand. The thing is that that's how we that time is just spending money and one fold it we can be seem like any other phone. Yes, they are. They make it no sense. Oh God, before you say anything, I want to public you really, really thank you very much, needles. And I'm hoping that Kevin really, really change the dynamics and change the way people feel about him. He's in our environment now. Let me see what he's going to do. So we, we'll be talking very, very often. Go ahead, my dear. Well, as I, I, I spoke to him last night, you know, telling the pros and cons that, you know, the discipline that I carry within my school. I live no one time straight up in front of him. I mean, the perception of what the guy looked like on the video compared to when you see him is a different person. You know, he looked more humble. He looked like a lama, as a matter of You know, and he really looked at that stage where I offer him a little something and tell him to get some snacks and you know, some breakfast and one Monday so that he drank a little something that night and so um, I did really just looking forward to see you later so we can you know kind of wrap up things and but my wife she's a deep up book boost she likes to put everything in order I saw that and, yeah so that's the kind of character she is and as much as she may be open to things she like that we have things black and white so everybody on the same page right but the guy the guy look all right man he look all right thank you thank you very much but you see me sometime during the day just call me first eh, because i may not be home i might be in and out all right call when you're coming. no problem all right then okay okay my dear thanks a lot again no problem. all right <laughs> angie Sorry, Miss Ar- Miss Aaron. Uh-huh. I hear you say just now when you see the place, you say, "Oh my God!" So what about the wow? Well, that passed the wow, Gil. Ow! Oh, oh, oh. I hear this, Miss Aaron. That passed the wow, yes. You know, you know what I observe? You see, you know those children how they are attached to him, eh? Mm-hmm. When we were leaving there, he left to come in the car with us. You know those children, those children. Did not run and ball for daddy or nothing. I observed. They stayed with the lady, comfortable. I observed that because we was looking for them to run out and cry behind him. They sat as a matter of fact when we reached, they were down to the boxes. Mm-hmm. They were at home, yeah. So you, you could you could know that they actually feeling the love there because they stayed with her while he came out the road with us. You know what I mean? So as I, as I said to him. The onus is on you. That's right. It's on him. The onus is on you. You have to work on yourself with whatever little help. And all the negativity, you have to prove that it is not so. You, Kevin, have to do that. All right? So have a good day. Talk to you later, Michelle. All right. Thank you very much. Jenny? I'm a Felix like a tag team. <laughs> I know for me to tell you I was now talking to Miss Angie there. I hear mm-hmm. Miss Angie on the phone. Um, mm-hmm. Miss Angie, I'm happy. Um, well, the situation has been part of the result because my passion is children and young people. People who know me will know that is where where my my hmm, where my emotions and stuff does go. Not emotionally sense of breakdown and cry, but in terms of I understand children, I understand what makes children sometimes behave the way they do. And as I was sharing with Miss Andre, I don't know what it is to be homeless with me and my mom after my mom had left my dad. And I know how traumatic it is when you don't know where you're going to sleep, hmm. when you see your mother sitting, crying, wondering what you will do. But my mother was a strong woman, a woman of a woman of God and a woman who didn't let things keep her down. She was a fighter, so she's never played herself as a victim, so I understand that. But the second I have on the children is one where they could feel insecure, that they, they feel not loved, they feel as if something is wrong with them, and they have they have panic attacks and all that. 
I have been fortunate that with whatever studies I would have done, I was able to put things in perspective. So I don't really have that issue. So that's why I'm always focused on those two little children. And the reason why I probably didn't run out yesterday when the father left, children are very intuitive. They would have felt the warmth, they would have felt the love, they would have felt that this is something. They would have felt at home. So that's why they wouldn't. And they felt the love of the people who would have embraced them in their home. And as everybody keeps saying, I won't add any more pressure to the things you'll see because Kevin has to understand there'll be a difference between pressure and motivation. So he can't look at everything that's happening wrong when people want to see him do good and tell him he needs to do this whatever as a pressure, but as a motivation to go forward. And that these two little children that he has, any time that he should mess up, children authorities will be called in because it wouldn't be allowed that he's out there all the time with these two little children. I told so him I told him that you know. So you yeah, have so you have an avenue in which you need to work hard yes, and accomplish that, that goal. So motivation. Yeah. The trend should act as his motivation, but not only do it for them alone, do it also for himself. Because if he's not comfortable with himself, no matter what he does to his trend, he will revert back to whatever negative attitudes and that kind of thing. So, Kevin, I'm sure you're listening still. Everything that is happening to you, put it into perspective. Look at his motivation. Look at it that you have been blessed with these two little children who have blessed you in return. Because I'm telling you, had you made that video and was you alone, people just watch it and just skip past it. But because of the cry of these two little children, because the Lord says, suffer little children to come unto me. I know big verse in the Bible. But you see the cries of those two little children, that is what saved you, Kevin. So you were blessed. I'm sure when you had those two children, you didn't see it like that. But those two children are your blessings. And because they are your blessings, you have to take care of them. And you have to take care of yourself so you'll be able to take care of them. So do everything that is necessary. And yes, sometimes you would fail. Sometimes you will slip, but you wouldn't fall because you have a safety net. However, don't take that net for granted. So in life, you'll always have negatives. In life, you'll always have setbacks. But you shake yourself off, you put it in perspective. Watch those two children and realize those two children are dependent on you to make it. But do not, do not set your standards so, so high when you know it's unattainable. So take one step at a time and reach to where you need to reach to. If you need a better paying job, you know you need to do certain things in place. So do everything in your power to succeed and not strive and take in so much that at the end of the day it's unattainable. But step by step, step by step, I mean, it's Felix in your corner, Titans of Democracy in your corner, with the people who you're living by in your corner, and with God also, with prayers also, you will make it. My mom made it, I made it, and my children are successful after God. It was not easy, but we never gave up. We stayed focused, we looked at what was in front of us, and we used it to our best of our ability, and you will succeed. It have no feeling in this. And I just wanted to say that because, again, children, we need to understand how fragile children's emotions are. And if you don't make a safe space for them, those children in years to come. Because remember the, the, the um, Babylon boy or something, so where the old children, they would have killed his family. His, he and his sister, and he experienced that. Nobody then take care of him after that. And I understand that boy sometimes is on the street. And he's just all around having whatever it is. That is how these things get started. So we don't want that for Kevin and his children. And Kevin, you also don't want that for your children. So we, I will make sure that I always in contact to find out how those children are going. Because they are our future. Dr. Ecolum spoke about it. We now came out of independence. The children are our future. The future is in the book bag. They have to get an education and they have to be productive in this new society that Dr. Keith Christopher Rowley, our transformational leader, speaks about. They are the ones to take up the mantle after. Thanks again, Mr. Thank you very much, Jenny. Jenny. All right, so guys, it's 8.37 a.m. Remember, today is the 1st of September, 2020. Let me take this opportunity to wish all of you celebrating birthdays today. Happy birthday to you. You know, I have a September born, eh? Yeah. My Hulk. My second born. Caller, good morning. 
Sharon, it's me again. Yes, my dear. Sharon, you realize I did not call in yesterday when you, you started your program. I wasn't here yesterday. I wasn't here yesterday. No, Sunday. Not yesterday. It's Sunday, Sunday. You, this book started right with this young man, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. Sharon, I was really, really touch and move, you know, so I didn't call you. But Sharon, we born different man, but the kind of heart you have, when the time it continue to... Mommy, where you going? I hear you, I hear right, you. Right, good. Right. I have called you many times when people need help, emergency thing, and you know, in this it is. What I can tell you, Sharon, you continue. And is Kevin is his name? Yes. Kevin is strong and be strong. Sharon, when I hear them children and them, I say, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, Sharon. Wow. I'll tell you one thing. I ain't leaving my children eh? I'm going, Sharon. If I have to eat one green fig with oil, mm-hmm. they have to eat that to you. Understand? But say what, he's a strong person and he will continue to make it through life, Sharon. You have a good one. Thank you very much. All right, so Trinidad and Tobago, do not shout. You need to whisper. We have to learn to have respect. Cola, good morning. Good morning, Sharon. Eh, eh, Burton, Trace, how you going, boy? Well, good in one way, but bad in sad in the next way, because we have to call it for to tell you that was not given we know what that all. Oh, God, again? Yes, yo. Since election day, they give us for about three days to, to, to get us to vote. And since that, they cut off the water on we yo. We ain't getting at all. This is two weeks now. Hmm. So hmm. I, I, I still have a call on the radio to air my my problem. If they, if they're listening, they will hear. Because we don't know who to go to. We call in the um, offices in Princess Town area and nothing at all. All right, send me a WhatsApp and I'll send it, pass it on for you. Well, um, I haven't got any WhatsApp, but um, oh, I could give you my number. All right. Um, you, you could take my number. I'll call you after. All right. Yeah, so that is the problem here with the water. Yeah. All right. Well, you, you know now, we use the um, Morgan table and see. Yes, Papa, you. Yeah, but where would you go? Sometimes in life you have to take things in a little stride. Maybe there was a reason for that. You never know. Yes, I said that. But thank God we won outright. Yes. All right, I'm going to send your number. I'm going to send your number to see if I get somebody to call you. Yeah, in Boston, you sent me a raise, Moruga. All right. Yes, thanks. Okay. Right. Let me tell them what to do. Please call. We better have a virtual party this morning before we leave. Sign me up, I come for this one. I never walk it properly. I wanna sign my signature, cross my T's. Cause I have all the requirements that you need. My resume is flawless, suitable, diverse, reliable. If you hire a I just want to go to work for Sadie. I come for this one. Sign me up, I come for this one. All right, so we have Tobago in the house. Good morning. Good morning, Sharon. Good morning. How are you today? Not bad. Good morning, Bruce. Morning, morning. Mr. Jacob? Yeah. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Your boy, cool. Nice. I just want to make a short contribution to that gentleman. Is Kevin his name? Yes, Kevin. Uh, one from me and one from my wife. Okay. And um, anybody could... Um, Call me now after and we'll talk. All right, sweetheart. You kiss Joan for me, please. <laughs> uh, 
every morning as you as you um, request. Very well, sir. <laughs> All right, sweetheart. You take care. All right, darling. All right, bye bye. <laughs> That's my family in law. Overseas line, good morning. Oh, that was a nice question. Shout out. The question is good morning, Miss Felix. Good morning, Bruce. No shouting. <laughs> whisper, whisper, whisper. Well, I like Canada. Miss Felix. Oh, God, oh, God. So much things to say, but. Not enough time, but I you know, yesterday you. would have been, um, yesterday and Sunday would have been nothing. He'll fun as well, and then it's I see you send me well. a picture. Is you send so me a picture? Yes, somebody else, huh? Did you send me a video? Somebody else, from somebody sent me something. No, 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 nothing. Okay, somebody, but um, I don't, I don't know if I did, but um, it, it was everything was virtual this year, you know, it was mm -hmm. a kind of different, kind of somber thing. But my cousin sent me, um, from Trinidad, sent me, I think, Kess was going to be on TV. Girl, it was. Oh, and, you know, my gosh. That would have been 1 o'clock a.m. this morning. Woo. And I went, I thought, let me go and take a sleep, and then I get up. Oh, God, I get up in time to see Kess singing. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, God, I wake up, but then I don't know what happened in the end. I didn't see the end. I see, I see the, the beginning, the middle, <laughs> and I ain't up happy in the end. The thing was watching me. But, um. You know, um, you see the, the young man thing, you know, Sunday I was trying to call him to, um, with Kevin and his kids, the things that happen. You know, sometimes in life, some people have to learn something. Yeah? When, 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 one thing I want people to who are listening to understand is you never kick a dog when it's down. Because one day that dog is going to get up and bite you. People, there's no perfect soul. People make mistakes, things happen. We all have a, a, a short fuse at times in life, you know? But let us just support each other and stop tearing each other down. I mean, if, if he ha everybody have an attitude, even if, put it this way, I saw a video with him, but I use that because the landlord who brought the soldiers and pictured him so bad, would I, would you, you know, sometimes things happen. You don't know what, you have to get the, the, the you know, a story has three sides. There's yours, there's mine, and someone in the middle, there's the truth. So, yes, he might have made mistakes, but you know what? I listened to him this morning calling you in, and he said, you know, he's ready to work, and, you know, and he got that help that he needed. And, Ms. Felix, I would tell you, um, as from this month, September, I'm going to, I don't know how long I'll be able to do it for, but I'll send something to you, uh, for you to pass on to him to help, you know? I would send, you know, some sterling, and I would tell you when, you know, and I'll give you the information and to, to collect it. Um, we have to stop tearing down one another. We need to support mm -hmm. and be our brothers, people, or sisters, whatever you want to say. And, you know, um, you know, we need to stop it because all you always see what's going on in this world right now, eh? It's a lot of, a lot of things happening, destruction, strive, a lot of things, and we can't you know, fight evil with evil, you know. So, um, Miss Felix, that's what I wanted to say. And, um, you know, I, I, I'll get to a banker when you see I can't get one because I'm <laughs> trying to find out. Well, this night, well, <laughs> Miss Felix, when it's 10 o'clock, come in here and I can't, I can't get nothing. Even a see me, I'm searching to see if anything, pick up on face, anything, anything, nothing. Oh, God, Miss Felix, why, all this, why Mr. Iowa George giving us such a hard time? Mr. It's George, not, if you're listening. It's not him, it's, it's the I internet. It's, it's always the internet. Not in the internet, girl. Sometimes the internet will be terrible. And that is what oh, carries. You see, people don't understand that there. carries the whole structure sometimes. The internet is what will take us to Facebook and YouTube. And then we have to go to Tobago. So if the internet given trouble, that's what that's the whole okay. thing here. Also the internet. Yep. Alright, I'll take that. So Mr. Love the show, listen, love some brutes. <laughs> I don't know if it's to be or if I should show. Anyways, have a nice day. Bye bye. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> Mrs. Rowley. Sharon. Do do. I hear holding on. Sharon now. I listen to this program. I listen to you all on, on, on this um this thing since Sunday. Mm hmm Since Sunday I've been listening to you. Sharon I'm not fooling you. For the past two years, I've been listening to you to see how what you are doing for people. 
I'm not fool. I listen to you, and I, I, I always, you know, you touch me as a good human being, a good human being, and people should be grateful. I think you come at that that station there for a purpose. I think you're on the air for a purpose. And what God placed you here for, don't care, you can't get away from it. I think God placed you there to do what you are doing. And may, the, may God be with you. I, I, hope, I wish you all the best. I wish you and, and Bruce by your side there. To, and your husband. I know how he does stand up with you in everything you want to do. Sharon, may God be with you. I'm praying for you. Don't tell last night. You know, my prayer session is midnight. Mm-hmm. Don't tell last night I get up and I'm praying, I'm praying. And asking the Lord to guide you and protect you. Because when you leave home and mornings coming down the road, if you know sometimes I get up here, half past four, and I'm traveling with you coming down the road. And wish that you reach down to the road safely and nothing happened to you. Because this is such a wicked world sometimes. So Sharon, God be with you. And I wish you all the best. Sharon, I can help. Because I'll tell you what. I take two children here from the parents. And all my time is taken up with them. And I'm a pensioner. I think you understand. Yes, yes, I know. Right? I'm a pensioner and I take these two children after mine then. Okay, so whatever it is, whatever small, sometimes that I could manage. Right? So you take care and keep on doing what you are doing. The Lord is with you and you are placed there for that purpose to help people. Okay? Thank you so much. All the best to you and have a good day. My prayers are always, always with you. God bless you. Thank you, my darling. And you know, I really want to say thank you to everybody who have that confidence in both Bruce and myself. And now we have the entire titans of democracy. So we have Village, we have Andrew, we have Mr. Chance, we have Fernand Moranzi, we have Angie, um, Jenny, we have Miss Cheryl Gordon. We have other people who do want to be mentioned, but we have a lot of people who have been working. Mm-hmm. Needles is also he's also part of our titans of democracy. We have a lot of people. Um, and just to sit down and listen is not good enough for me. Yes, we do it as a team. I may be the one pushing forward, but it's a team effort. Because like yesterday, we were in Superia, heading to La Brea. I had to call Angie and Village to take up the slack to go down to do the needs and get the gentleman and his children settling into the apartment. And when I tell you, Bruce know the place because it's Bruce is really, it's really Bruce's friend. The place? Ha, yeah, yeah. <laughs> all it? Yeah, ha, Lord. Ah, look. Need, all I could say is needles, boy. I want to really thank you, thank you, thank you and your wife and her. Yeah. You know the onus is on me to make sure that everything is above board and I promise to really follow through on that. Caller, good morning. A pleasant good morning to you, Sister hey, Sharon. Singing Francine. Oh my gosh, girl. If I had to make an appointment to get through to this <laughs> anyway. <laughs> the main thing is that I got through a present. Good morning to Brother Bruce. Morning, morning. Oh, I miss you, sweetheart. Listen, I just want to add a little bit to what Sister Jenny said. Morning, Sister Jenny, Mr. Chance, everybody, all the titans of democracy. To the gentleman with his two little children. I was trying to get through since Sunday. My heart broke. I want to tell you this. Under all of what happened and all that we did physically, I want this man to pray. Yeah. Go down on his knees, even if it's the 23rd Psalm, the 20th Psalm, the 91 Psalm, and say, talk to God and teach his children, even if it is to say, gentle Jesus. Regardless of all the money and the monetary things that we got, 
I want to tell you something without God. You are nothing. We are nothing. Go down on your knees. Hold your children in each arm. And say, gentle Jesus, meek and mild. Look upon this little child. I want to tell her it is. Children, our blessings and our future. And you don't know one of them or both of them could grow up to be like our great prime minister. You got to make the way and pave the way for the children. Listen, giving them some food and a shelter is very important. But prayer beats everything, Sharon, and I want to thank you for the work that you are doing. Because if you if you did not cry as that voice in the wilderness, people would not hear you. And because of your cry, everybody came forward, even if they couldn't do it physically, they did it mentally. And I just want to thank you all for what you are doing. You are just an Angie and just a Jenny. Mr. Chance, everybody that helped in some way or other, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. And keep up the good work. I love you all. Bye-bye. Mother Tonapuna, I love you, Sita. God bless you and thanks for all your prayers. Bye-bye. Thank you so, so much. My dear, and I was singing Francine. And guys, the word for today is zeal, but I can't read it because we have to go. And of course, I begin every day with zeal. Mm. So Trinidad and Tobago, this is where we leave it for today. Talk to you tomorrow morning. Please, God, we're gone. Bruce, mm -hmm. Sharon, Felix. Ciao. Ciao. Looking for a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp 1-868-398-8282. Or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. Finally, a line of baking products that caters for the gluten-free, cholesterol-free, egg-free, and dairy-free person. Enriched with sesame, flax meal, and chai seeds. Also try our line of seasonings and spices that are ideal for diabetic, kidney, heart, colon, and hypertensive persons. Perfect for the whole family. Healthy O, the healthier way to go. Find it in a supermarket near you. Hi, good day people. This is your nutritional educator here, as you know. The whole thing is about educating people. So, you see, when you're educated, you can make better choices when coming to your health and your wellness. And this is what we're about here at Natural Solution Education. That's the first premise of our doctor. That's what it means, is to educate people so they can make better choices. Now, Today what we want to show you, we spoke about having what we call our central immune protectors and immune enhancers. This is what we're going to be sharing with you today. Right? Now, we want to start by the Oxylife. You could have mentioned this already. Now, the Oxylife is your hydrogen peroxide. And as I said before, the senior people will be quite familiar with this because this is used, as you can see here on the chart, for a number of things. Now, primarily what we're using this for is to disinfect the system. This sits on the same periodic table as bleach. What do I mean? The same ability that bleach will have to kill all viruses, bacteria, um, antifungal, etc. is the same protection we get with this, but of course the human body can handle this. Now with this, you're taking three drops three times a day and this will release and expand oxygen in your system. And as we know, once oxygen in the system, um, body is able to heal. The medical fraternity always knew that. The thing is, the challenge is to have oxygen stable enough in a particular area in uh, enough time to cause change. What we have is the oxylite that will do a good job in that area. There's a range of issues here. And by the way, this will protect you from a number of things, especially those of you who suffer respiratory problems. 
here we have the what we call the liquid chlorophyll. Now chlorophyll is one of my favorites because this has the ability to cleanse and detoxify the blood. Under a microscope, guys, this looks the identical way to the human blood um, and even the platelets because the difference is this has magnesium at its base and of course your other cells have iron at its base and its core. But it's the same thing, meaning that this will be able to help to build the blood. For those of you who have low blood count and issues in your blood, this is excellent for building blood and detoxifying the body. I promise you guys, if you take this for um, for three months straight, it will deodorize your body to the point where you would experience no morning breath, you will sweat, but you will get no scent, and most importantly, as I tell persons, and they laugh sometimes, you will use this and you will defecate, and there will be no scent. Completely deodorize the system. Uh, of course, you know about our super silver has become very, very famous, and I do have to mention about this much before people know the benefits of silver. Uh, as a matter of fact, silver is what they use before the advent of antibiotics. This is nature's antibiotic people. It will kill those bacteria, those microorganisms, or pathogens, as we call them, without harming the immune system. So this is big time. And this is something that every household should have. You should have this in your medicine cabinet. We talk about functional medicine here, that you can reach for this if your child scrapes, they have a bruise, a cut, what have you. Um, if you take this, you take it about one tablespoon twice or three times a day, depending on the size of the individual, and this will protect you even in this time where we have viruses going around. So this is your silver super silver. Let's talk very quickly about this minerals. Now we refer to this as Ormus minerals, and if you go online, you will see a lot about the power of these Ormus minerals. Now minerals are important, as we know. We take in vitamin C, we take in fruits and vegetables. But unless you have certain minerals, uh, the body will not be able to synthesize, it will not be able to metabolize and utilize vitamins the way it should be. All right? Good morning, I am Vanessa Thomas with the Tobago News at 9 a.m. on the Street 919 FM and online Facebook and YouTube. TT Post issues statement to its Tobago customers, explaining that the spread of the COVID-19 pandemic throughout the country has temporarily reduced its capacity for service delivery and therefore forced the corporation to make changes to the distribution of pension and other social welfare checks to customers, including those who usually receive their checks out of its Cabo and Bonacord outlets while meeting its delivery deadline. September 2020 checks, which are usually distributed via the Scarborough and Bonacord outlets, will be distributed from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. at various post offices and community centers. Those pensioners and other social welfare grant recipients who are unable to go to their designated collection point due to age, infirmity, or disability are asked to call the hotlines at 489-401, 489-408 or 489-4198 for special delivery arrangements to be made. TT Post apologizes for any inconvenience caused but have taken these steps to ensure that the checks are distributed by the scheduled date of September 1st, notwithstanding the prevailing circumstances. TT Post says it will continue to take extraordinary measures to meet its obligations to all the citizens of Trinidad and Tobago. The Postal Service wishes to thank you for your understanding in this matter and asks that you adhere to all the protocols established by the Ministry of Health. Affected people are asked to check out TT Post Facebook for more information on this. In other news, the Miss Tobago Heritage Personality 2020 competition themed Tracing Legacies will be aired as a four-part series. The first was aired on Saturday. Because of COVID-19 restrictions, the Tobago Festivals Commission decided to pre-record the annual Tobago Heritage Festival, which also incorporates the Miss Heritage Personality competition. The organizing committee said the next two episodes of the competition 
usually hosted at the Sid Gray Sporting Complex will be shown on the Facebook pages of Tobago Channel 5, TTT and the Tobago Festivals Commission on September 5th and 12th. The final will be aired on September 19th. Finally, a new hotel development may be coming to Tobago. The announcement was made by THA's Chief Secretary and Secretary of Tourism, Ansel Dennis. He said there is a serious possibility that within the next two to three years or so, there would be another major hotel development in the form of a five-star resort in southwest Tobago. While speaking to the media at a post-executive council, Dennis said this development would add another 1,000 more rooms to the island's high-end stock and more information would be revealed at the appropriate time. And that's a brief look at news in Tobago on the Street 919 FM and online Facebook and YouTube. Stay tuned for a news update at 10 o'clock, another at 11, and major news at 12. I am Vanessa Thomas. Do enjoy your morning. For a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp 1-866-398-8282. Or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. Finally, a line of baking products that caters for uh, who departed this life at the age of 89 on Monday, 24th of August at the San Fernando General Hospital. She will be lovingly remembered as the daughter of the late Albert and Cordelia Lawrence, both of Karyaku, wife of the late Nathan Moses, good friend of the late O'Neill Alexander, adopted mother of Jacintha, Lodric, and Daphne, sister of Evelyn, who is deceased, Thomas, Lorna, Margaret, Faith Ina, and Josephine, aunt of many in law of the Moses family and many others, relative of the Lawrence, Dick, Montrose, Cummings, Collins and Allard families, friend of many. Public viewing for the late Martha Lawrence, a.k.a. Teacher Nesta, will take place on Wednesday, 2nd of September at 1.30 p.m. at the Temple of the Truth and Living God Church, Mora Point 14, followed by a private service at 2 p.m. then is on to the Point 14 Cemetery. For inquiries, you can call the Elite Funeral Homes Limited at 6483462. Looking for a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp 1-866-398-8282. Or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. Finally, a line of baking products that caters for the gluten-free, cholesterol-free, egg-free, and dairy-free person. Enriched with sesame, flax meal, and chai seeds. Also try our line of seasonings and spices that are ideal for diabetic, kidney, heart, colon, and hypertensive persons. Perfect for the whole family. Healthy O, the healthier way to go. Find it in a supermarket near you. Hi, good day people. This is your nutritional educator here, as you know. The whole thing is about educating people. So, you see, when you're educating, you can make better choices when coming to your health and your wellness. And this is what we're about here at Natural Solution Education. That's the first premise of a doctor. That's what it means, is to educate people so they can make better choices. Now, Today what we want to show you, we spoke about having what we call our central immune protectors and immune enhancers. This is what we're going to be sharing with you today. Right? Now, we're going to start by the Oxylife, 
you do not mention this already. Now the oxidite is your hydrogen peroxide and like I said before, the senior people will be quite familiar with this because this is used as you can see here on the chart for a number of things. Now primarily what we're using this for is to disinfect the system. This sits on the same periodic table as bleach. What do I mean? The same ability that bleach will have to kill all viruses, bacteria, um, antifungal, etc. It's the same protection I get with this, but of course the human body can handle this. Now with this, you're taking three drops three times a day, and this will release and expand oxygen in the system. And as we know, once oxygen in the system, um, body is able to heal. The medical fraternity always knew that. The thing is, the challenge is to have oxygen stable enough in a particular area in uh, enough time to cause change. What we have is the oxylite that will do a good job in that area. There's a range of issues here. And by the way, this will protect you from a number of things, especially those of you suffering respiratory problems. Here we have the, what we call the liquid chlorophyll. Now chlorophyll is one of my favorites because this has the ability to cleanse and detoxify the blood. Under a microscope, guys, this looks the identical way to the human blood um, and even the platelets because the difference is this has magnesium at its base and of course your other cells have iron at its base in its core. But it's the same thing, meaning that this will be able to help to build the blood. For those of you who have low blood count and issues in blood, this is excellent for building blood and detoxifying the body. I promise you guys, if you take this for um, for three months straight, it would deodorize your body to the point where you would experience no morning breath, you will sweat, but you will get no scent, and most importantly, as I tell persons, and they laugh sometimes, you will use this and you will defecate, and there will be no scent. Completely deodorize the system. Uh, of course, you know about our super silver has become very, very famous, and I do have to mention about this much before people know the benefits of silver. Uh, as a matter of fact, silver is what they use before the advent of antibiotics. This is nature's antibiotic people. It will kill those bacteria, those microorganisms or pathogens as we call them, without harming the immune system. So this is big time. And this is something that every household should have. You should have this in your medicine cabinet. We talk about functional medicine here, that you can reach for this if your child scraped, they have a bruise, a cut, what have you. Um, if you take this, you take it about one tablespoon twice or three times a day, depending on the size of the individual, and this will protect you even in this time where we have viruses going around. So this is your silver super silver. Let's talk very quickly about this minerals. Now, we refer to this as almost minerals, and if you go online, you will see a lot about the power of these almost minerals. Now, minerals are important, as we know. We take in vitamin C, we take in fruits and vegetables, but unless you have certain minerals, uh, the body will not be able to synthesize, it will not be able to metabolize and utilize vitamins the way it should be. All right? So this is important. So again, we have more minerals, and by the way, this includes essential minerals as well. Here we have, this is our little hand sanitizer, we put it a silver gel. And once the light hits, the color will change, okay? And that's because it should be silver particles in here. You can use as a hand sanitizer for cuts and bruises, etc. Um, I want to share this with you in this short video. Our muscular here spoke about this. We had literally thousands of testimonies with this powerful uh, product before, but we it was out of circulation. So we are so happy to have this now at a time that people need this. The benefits of muscadine is that it has over 100 antioxidants. Some of them are classified as pro antioxidants and some are anthocyanins. To cut a long story short, these things have different functions in the body. Diabetes, circulation, heart disease, a variety of things you can use this for, as well as protection. So we want to leave you now a natural solution. We'll see you in another video soon to educate you as we do our education drive. All right? Blessings. I just can't trust them and I like I stem frozen, like I stem frozen. Be careful of the friends you keep. They don't have no mercy, they don't have no mercy. Be careful of the friends you keep. You pull them up.
them push you down, sink the ship and let you drown. When them done, them run left you. And leave you standing like Daniel in a lion's day. Now we face and deny we Have you watch we back when them around we Them a wolf in sheep loading around we Them smile in your face, them a snake in the grass Always have on the mask Always have on the mask Who no give me pass, yeah, yeah Peter the night job Have to sit and break bread So how can I just mark
Everybody, 
out. Yeah, thanks. Um, you don't need to them like I'm ready for you. I'm set. So, you know what you're Say no more. Ah, uh, yes. For the brands and the bling and the expensive thing on I never had the money, never had nice living And mama say, oh, you could have it all Just work hard for yours I say, mama, you know, I work hard for sure Now Jaja bless me with the opportunity to fly country to country Now I could drink champagne when I thirst Now I could see the only thing I never see They say, this is why you been so long But I thank me for the run the family Now no bad mind, boy, they can stop me And every show I smile Life is so lovely, whoa.
past and the people who laugh oh, now. Forever grateful for all the times I've failed. And Papa said, oh, son, you can't give up. What's for you, it's for you. I said, Papa, you know I will never stop, no. Now Jaja bless me with the opportunity to fly country to country. Now I could drink champagne when I thirsty. Now I could see all the things I never see. They say this how I eat man so lucky. But I thank you for the run me from me. Now no bad mind boy, they can stop me. And every show I'm smiling cause trust me. Love is so lovely, boy. And I'm far from finished. Hey, Pope, play me the rhythm. But what's Christian? This is a madman. I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. This is a drunkard. I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. What's me when I drink? Tu 
Yo, tell everybody I reach. I'm coming inside right now. Wait for it. <laughs> then you're gonna feel it. Yeah, and can you feel the rhythm? Wait, 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 wait,
song you promised. You say get go make two party and make Ricky. Get go make Yakara and go make Charlie. So now when this song you promised me, so tell him so now. What so now? So now. So now. Tell him so now when this song you promised. Everybody know that we is bad now. Since the days of Nani and Nana. Now that's the man who really started the track me. And paved the way for Ricky and to party. So now I'm going to do for you a chutney jam. I must go to the best composer in the land. And the best chutney composer everybody knows. There's nobody else but so down for four. Tell him so down. Wait a So now when he song your promise. He say get go make you party. Can you make Ricky? It go make your karate. And go make Charlie. So now when he song your promise me. Tell him, tell him so now. So now. So now. So now. The man from Himalaya Club don't tell me That he want me come and sing with Rabini Boy, he from Barapo, he don't start planning Yes, he want me come and sing in Rukmin wedding Everybody waiting on this Dutchie jam But so now leave me like a list in Wonderland Yes, I finally carry in this thing to break it far Like he don't want me be no superstar what what? So now it is on your promise. With the 10 a.m. news update on the street now on 9 FM and online Facebook and YouTube. Attorney General Faris Al Arawi on Monday said that the new mask wearing legislation applies to all, including the socially displaced. He said that face masks are being distributed to persons with difficulties in their situation and to the socially displaced. The AG said that the initiative is to ensure that such persons can comply with the amendment to the public health ordinance. A bill to make provisions for fixed penalty notices for breaches, including wearing face masks in public, was passed in the Senate on Saturday. In other news, a 25-year-old man was shot dead Monday afternoon in Mova. He has been identified as Hashiam Clark of Basilon Street, East Dry River, Port of Spain. According to police reports, at about 5.30 p.m., residents of Wallace Road in Chinapu, Mova, heard a commotion followed by several loud explosions. Upon investigating, they found Clark and a woman bleeding from injuries about their bodies. A group of people were seen fleeing the scene. The police and paramedics were notified, however, Clark succumbed to his injuries. The female victim was taken to the Port of Spain General Hospital in a serious condition, where she remained warded up to this morning. Finally, a 56-year-old woman was killed in a vehicular accident on Monday. She has been identified as Patricia Kisun Ruth of Kunjal Road, Barakpur. According to police reports, at about 3 a.m. on Monday, Kasun Ruth was driving a blue BMW SUV in a westerly direction along the Rochard Douglas Road. As she approached the cemetery, the vehicle veered off the road and collided with a wall. Police believe the woman may have fallen asleep behind the wheel. Barakpo police are expected to view CCTV footage from cameras set up in the area. And that was the 10 a.m. news update on the Street Now 9 FM and online Facebook and YouTube. Stay tuned for another news update at 11, major news at 12. I am Vanessa Thomas. Good morning. Looking for a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. 
Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp 1-868-398-8282. Or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. Finally, a line of baking products that caters for the gluten-free, cholesterol-free, egg-free, and dairy-free person. Enriched with sesame, flax meal, and chai seeds. Also try our line of seasonings and spices that are ideal for diabetic, kidney, heart, colon, and hypertensive persons. Perfect for the whole family. Healthy O, the healthier way to go. Find it in a supermarket near you. Hi, good day, people. This is your nutritional educator here, as you know. The whole thing is about educating people. So, you see, when you're educated, you can make better choices when coming to your health and your wellness. And this is what we're about here at Natural Solution Education. That's the first premise of a doctor. That's what it means, is to educate people so they can make better choices. Now, Today what we want to show you, we spoke about having what we call our central immune protectors and immune enhancers. This is what we're going to be sharing with you today. Right? Now, we're going to start by the Oxylite. You could have mentioned this already. Now, the Oxylite is your hydrogen peroxide. And like I said before, you see here people will be quite familiar with this because this is used, as you can see here on the chart, for a number of things. Now, primarily what we're using this for is to disinfect the system. This sits on the same periodic table as bleach. What do I mean? The same ability that bleach will have to kill all viruses, bacteria, um, antifungal, etc. is the same protection I get with this, but of course the human body can handle this. Now with this, you're taking three drops, three times a day, and this will release and expand oxygen in the system. And as we know, once oxygen in the system, um, body is able to heal. The medical fraternity always knew that. The thing is, the challenge is to have oxygen stable enough in a particular area in uh, enough time to cause change. What we have is the oxylite that will do a good job in that area. There's a range of issues here. And by the way, this will protect you from a number of things, especially those of you suffering respiratory problems. Here we have the, what we call the liquid chlorophyll. Now chlorophyll is one of my favorites because this has the ability to cleanse and detoxify the blood. Under a microscope, guys, this looks the identical way to the human blood um, and even the platelets because the difference is this has magnesium at its base and of course your other cells have iron at its base and its core, but it's the same thing, meaning that this will be able to help to build the blood for those of you who have low blood count and issues in blood, this is excellent for building blood and detoxifying the body. I promise you guys, if you take this for, um, for three months straight, it will deodorize your body to the point where you would experience no morning breath, you will sweat but you will get no scent, and most importantly, as I tell persons, and they laugh sometimes, you will use this and you will defecate and there will be no scent. Completely deodorize the system. Uh, of course, you know about our super silver has become very, very famous. And I do have to mention about this much before people know the benefits of silver. Uh, as a matter of fact, silver is what they use before the advent of antibiotics. This is nature's antibiotic people. It will kill those bacteria, those microorganisms or pathogens as we call them, without harming the immune system. So this is big time. And this is something that every household should have. You should have this in your medicine cabinet. We're talking about functional medicine here, that you can reach for this if your child is scraped, they have a bruise, a cut, what have you. Um, if you take this, you take it about one tablespoon twice or three times a day, depending on the size of the individual, and this will protect you even in this time where we have viruses going around. So this is your silver, super silver. Let's talk very quickly about this minerals. Now, we refer to this as hormones minerals. And if you go online, you will see a lot about the power of these hormones minerals. Now, minerals are important, as we know. We take in vitamin C, we take in fruits and vegetables. But unless you have certain minerals, uh, the body
body will not be able to synthesize, it will not be able to metabolize and utilize vitamins the way it should be. Alright? So this is important. So again, we have our minerals, and by the way, this includes essential minerals as well. Here we have, this is our little hand sanitizer, referred to as silver gel. And once the light hits this, the color will change, okay? And that's because it should be silver particles in here. You can use as a hand sanitizer for cuts and bruises, etc. Um, I want to share this with you in this short video. Our mascara, I here spoke about this. We had literally thousands of testimonies with this powerful uh, product before, but we it was out of circulation. So we are so happy to have this now at the time that people need this. The benefits of muscadine is that it has over 100 antioxidants. Some of them are classified as proanthocyanins and some are anthocyanins. To cut a long story short, these things have different functions in the body. Diabetes, circulation, heart disease, a variety of things you can use this for, as well as protection. So we want to leave you now a natural solution. We'll see you in another video soon to educate you as we do our education and drive. Alright? Blessings. Yes, man, I eat it. I just can't trust them and I like I stem frozen, like I stem frozen. Be careful of the friends you keep. Then I have no mercy, then I have no mercy. Be careful of the friends you keep. You pull them up, they push you down, sink the ship and let you drown. When them done, them run left you. And leave you standing like Daniel in a lion stand. Around we, we're looking at with yes and deny we. Happy watch we back when them around we. Them a wolf in sheep loading around we. Them smile in your face, them a snake in the grass. Always have on the mask. Always have on the mask. Who no give me pass? Yeah, yeah. Peter the night job. Have to sit and break bread. So how can I? Like ice them frozen, like ice them frozen. Be careful of the friends you keep. Then I have no mercy, then I have no mercy. Be careful of the friends you keep. You pull them up, they push you down. Sink the ship and let you drown. When them done, them run left you. And leave you standing like Daniel in a lion stand. We face and deny we Happy watch we back when them around we Them a wolf in sheep loading around we Them smile in your face Them a snake in the grass Always have on the mask Always have on the mask Who no give me pass Yeah yeah Peter the night job Have to sit and break bread So how can I just mind So how can I just mind when 
from the same vine. Peter the night job, after sit and break bread. So how can I just mourn when we come from the same vine? Peter the night job, after sit and break bread. So how can I just mourn when we come from the same vine? I grew up as a real good girl, always home, don't go nowhere. As soon as I was introduced to Carnival, they say I lose. All down on the ground, walking, walking up the bottom, and it dragging, dragging all over tongue, and they say I lose. It was never a party at my school bazaar. I used to go, but since I was introduced to Baka, now they say I lose. When I drop it hot and I
watch when we go down the wine. Hold on, but you're something feeling good. And she ball, hola, 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 hola. She ball, hola, 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 she got me name. She ball, hola, 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 she got me name. And she said, hola, tell them all. That you come with, tell them who love you don't say. Girl, let me see you with no behavior. Do your business, you see. And pretend you're in front of the mirror. But this that thing there for me. Girl, your body looking good. And you could be in a mood. When you wind your wife so good, yeah. Then she ball up, hola. She grab on me thing like, hola. And then I give she the thing like, hola. I mash up the place and you know you're whining good. She ball up, hola. Just give me some time now, hola. She want me to down the wine now. Bye. 
And the bling and the expensive thing on I never had the money, never had nice living. And mama say, Oh, you could have it all. Just work hard for yours. I say, Mama, you know I look hard for sure. Now Jaja bless me with the opportunity to fly country to country. Now I could drink champagne when I thirst. Now I could see only thing I never see. They say this how I you pan so long. But I thank me for the run the family. No, no bad mind, boy, they can stop me. And every show I smile. Life is so lovely, whoa.
opportunity to fly country to country. Now I could drink champagne when I thirsty. Now I could see all the thing I never see. They say this how I eat man so lucky. But I thank you for the run if I'm there. No, no bad mind, boy, they can stop there. And every show I'm smiling, cause trust me, love is so lovely, boy. And I'm far from finished. Hey, pop, play me the rhythm. But what is this? This is a madman. I go mine. I go mine. I go mine. This is a drunkard. I go mine. I go mine. I go mine. What's me when I drink? Take a wine. 
Bah oui, Christian. Slum, just a mile in it. Saltfish, saltfish, saltfish. Come on, sit. Saltfish. What they drop them cookies? Saltfish. Chew them on it. Saltfish, saltfish. When they drop them cooking saltfish, they just soak it good. Soak it, soak it, soak it good. Jab jab never use no stove. We heat it up with some firewood. Soak it, soak it. So get good and put it big in the salt fish. Saboka in the salt fish. If I cook in the salt fish, my hand will be in the salt fish. And I go bring she salt fish. Now I go bring she salt fish. When we season the salt fish, nothing sweeter than salt fish. Listen before you talk. We have a cook on the block. Them fellas go bring the wood. Them ladies go bring the pot. And before the fire start, somebody run in the shop and get a couple of pounds of flour, cut dumpling going in that. When they jab their cooking salt fish, they just soak it good. Soak it, soak it, soak it good. Jab jab never use no stove, we heat it up with some firewood. Soak it, soak it, soak it good. And put it big in the salt fish, Zaboka in the salt fish. If I cook in the salt fish, my hand will be in the salt fish. We never go bring sea salt fish, Valim go bring sea salt fish. When we season the salt fish, nothing sweeter than salt fish. When it comes to jab, salt fish could never waste. We eat till we barely full, and we rub it all with peace. Elizabeth says she like. Power to up she own When I put in cucumber She don't want me to take out the bone When the jab jab cook in salt fish We just soak it good Soak it, soak it Soak it good Jab jab never use no stove We hit it up with some firewood Soak it, soak it Soak it good And put it big in the salt fish Saboka in the salt fish If I cook in the salt fish My hand go be in the salt fish We hand go bring she salt fish Patrice go bring she salt fish When we season the salt fish Nothing sweeter than salt fish Fama you get a taste Brooklyn say how we want When nobody ain't watch it He tip a piece in the front Well you know jab in shame You know the jab jab in care And you see Juve morning We don't want a salt fish with here When the jab jab cook in salt fish Let the soak it good Soak it, soak it, soak it good. Jab jab never use no stove. We heat it up with some firewood. Soak it, soak it, soak it good. And put it big in the salt fish. Saboka in the salt fish. If I cook in the salt fish, my hand will be in the salt fish. And I go bring she salt fish. Now I go bring she salt fish. When we season the salt fish, nothing sweeter than salt fish. When the jab jab cook in salt fish, we just soak it good. Soak it, soak it, soak it good. Just a mile in it.
Sweet Sweet When Sweet 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 Sweet
man from Himalaya Club don't tell me That he won't me come and sing with Rabini Boy, is he from Barapo, he don't start planning Yes, he won't me come and sing in Rookman wedding Everybody waiting on this teacher But to not leave me like a list in Wonderland Yes, I finally carry in this thing to play guitar Like he don't want me be no superstar Tell him to not wait What, what? Wait this So now wait this song, you promise He say get to make you party And make Ricky Get to make your karate And go make Charlene So now wait this song, you promise me Look, so now So now So now So now So now where this song you promised me Enough respect to the man Every day the politician talking Now every day is only race again So I want him write a song about unity Between Africans and Indians in this country Yes, I want him write a song so that the world could know In we music, it don't have no race in trade, big old. It's just some politicians who looking for both Want to push racial in the tongue we throw
the 11 a.m. news update on the Street 919 FM and online Facebook and YouTube. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley has called on young people to take responsibility for stopping the spread of COVID-19 in Trinidad and Tobago. His Independence Day message said the infection rate is growing most rapidly among the younger age groups 25 to 35. To the young people of this small country, the Prime Minister asked that you make an immediate contribution and take responsibility for stopping the spread of the virus in your circles. He added that a lot of young people believe that they are invincible, but now is not the time to wager bets on your health and the health of people around you. Dr. Raul he called on young people to protect their clips, their crews, and their limes, and become protectors for and of each other. He warned that to do otherwise for fun, frolic, and bravado is to invite unspeakable disaster. Meanwhile, County Medical Officer of Health for Carony, Dr. Janine St. Bernard, has appealed to COVID-19 positive patients who are in quarantine at home to be truthful when contacted by medical professionals. St. Bernard made the appeal during Monday's virtual COVID-19 press conference. She said it was critical that people say what their symptoms are because if they downplay them, it could lead to a dangerous situation. St. Bernard said there were reports of COVID-19 with positive people who are quarantined at home were not wearing masks. She said all people in the households should wear masks as much as possible and stay away from the at-risk family member as much as possible. She added to prevent person-to-person -person spread, one should not share towels, cutlery or glasses. Meanwhile, the Ministry of Health this morning reported three more COVID-19 deaths, bringing the total COVID deaths to 25. 14 additional persons have tested positive for COVID-19. 19, 13 persons tested positive in Trinidad and one person tested positive in Tobago. The ministry says the number of samples submitted to the Caribbean Public Health Agency, UOE and other local sites for testing are 23,651. Finally, a 28-year-old female is Jamaica's latest COVID-19 death. The Ministry of Health and Wellness said at the same time in the last 24 hours, Jamaica recorded 245 new confirmed COVID-19 cases, the largest one-day increase on record. These bring the total cases on record for the island to 2,357. Of the newly confirmed cases, 116 are female and 100 are males with ages ranging from 2 weeks to 90 years old. And that was the 11 a.m. news update on the Street 919 FM and online Facebook and YouTube. Stay tuned for major news at noon. I am Vanessa Thomas. Good morning. Looking for a safe and relaxed professional massage therapist and nutritionist? Look no further. Nature's Touch with Empress Judy and Associates offers a natural approach to better health. Treat yourself to a professional massage therapy and nutrition advice in a safe and relaxed atmosphere. Rejuvenate your body, mind and soul at Nature's Touch Therapy. For an appointment, please call or WhatsApp 1-866-398-8282 or visit our Facebook page. Remember, your health is our responsibility at Nature's Touch. Finally, a line of baking products that caters for the gluten-free, cholesterol-free, egg-free, and dairy-free person. Enriched with sesame, flax meal, and chai seeds. Also try our line of seasonings and spices that are ideal for diabetic, kidney, heart, colon, and hypertensive persons. Perfect for the whole family. Healthy O, the healthier way to go. Find it in a supermarket near you. Hi, good day people. This is your nutritional educator here, as you know. The whole thing is about educating people. So, you see, when you're educated, you can make better choices when coming to your health and your wellness. And this is what we're about here at Natural Solution Education. That's the first premise of a doctor. That's what it means, is to educate people so they can make better choices. Now, Today what we want to show you, we spoke about having what we call our central immune protectors and immune enhancers. This is what we're going to be sharing with you today. All right? Now, we're going to start by the Oxylife. You could have mentioned this already. Now, the Oxylife is your hydrogen peroxide. And like I said before, you see here people will be quite familiar with this. Because
because this is used, as you can see here on the chart, for a number of things. Now, primarily what we're using this for is to disinfect the system. This sits on the same periodic table as bleach. What do I mean? The same ability that bleach will have to kill all viruses, bacteria, um, antifungal, etc. is the same protection I get with this, but of course the human body can handle this. Now with this, you're taking three drops three times a day, and this will release and expand oxygen in the system. And as we know, once oxygen in the system, um, body is able to heal. The medical fraternity always knew that. The thing is, the challenge is to have oxygen stable enough in a particular area in uh, enough time to cause change. What we have is the oxylite that will do a good job in that area. There's a range of issues here. And by the way, this will protect you from a number of things, especially those of you suffering respiratory problems. Here we have the, what we call the liquid chlorophyll. Now chlorophyll is one of my favorites because this has the ability to cleanse and detoxify the blood. Under a microscope, guys, this looks the identical way to the human blood um, and even the platelets because the difference is this has magnesium at its base and of course your other cells have iron at its base and its core but it's the same thing, meaning that this will be able to help to build the blood. For those of you who have low blood count and issues in blood, this is excellent for building blood and detoxifying the body. I promise you guys, if you take this for um, for three months straight, it would deodorize your body to the point where you would experience no morning breath, you will sweat, but you will get no scent, and most importantly, as I tell persons, and they laugh sometimes, you will use this and you will defecate, and there will be no scent. Completely deodorize the system. Uh, of course, you know about our super silver has become very, very famous, and I do have to mention about this much before people know the benefits of silver. Uh, as a matter of fact, silver is what they use before the advent of antibiotics. This is nature's antibiotic people. It will kill those bacteria, those microorganisms or pathogens as we call them, without harming the immune system. So this is big time. And this is something that every household should have. You should have this in your medicine cabinet. We talk about functional medicine here, that you can reach for this if your child scraped, they have a bruise, a cut, what have you. Um, if you take this, you take it about one tablespoon twice or three times a day, depending on the size of the individual, and this will protect you even in this time where we have viruses going around. So this is your silver super silver. Let's talk very quickly about this minerals. Now, we refer to this as almost minerals, and if you go online, you will see a lot about the power of these almost minerals. Now, minerals are important, as we know. We take in vitamin C, we take in fruits and vegetables, but unless you have certain minerals, uh, the body will not be able to synthesize, it will not be able to metabolize and utilize vitamins the way it should be. All right? So this is important. So again, we have more minerals, and by the way, this includes essential minerals as well. Here we have, this is our little hand sanitizer, we put it a silver gel. And once the light hits, there's a color will change, okay? And that's because it shouldn't be silver particles in here. You can use as a hand sanitizer for cuts and bruises, etc. Um, I want to share this with you in this short video. Our muscular here spoke about this. We have literally thousands of testimonies with this powerful uh, product before, but we it was out of circulation. So we are so happy to have this now at the time that people need this. The benefits of muscadine is that it has over 100 antioxidants. Some of them are classified as pro antioxidants and some are anthocyanins. To cut a long story short, these things have different functions in the body. Diabetes, circulation, heart disease, a variety of things you can use this for, as well as protection. So we want to leave you now a natural solution. We'll see you in another video soon to educate you as we do our education drive. All right? Blessings. I just can't trust them and I'm like I stem frozen, like I stem frozen. Be careful of the friends you keep. They don't have no mercy, they don't have no mercy. Be careful of the friends you keep. You pull them up, they push you down, sink the ship and let you drown. When them done, them run left you. And leave you standing like Daniel in a lion's day. Sit and break bread. 
So how can I just man when we come from the same vine? Peter the Niger, after sit and break bread. So how can I just man when we come from the same vine? Say we no want them Judas around we. We looking at we face and deny we. Happy watch we back when them around we. Them a wolf in sheep loading around we. Them smile in your face, them a snake in the grass. Always about the mass. Always about the mass. Who no give me pass? Yeah, yeah. Peter the Niger. After sit and break bread. So how can I just man when we come from the same vine? Peter the Niger. After sit and break bread. So how can I just mark when we come from the same vine? Them frozen, be careful of the friends you keep. Then I have no mercy, then I have no mercy. Be careful of the friends you keep. You pull them up, then push you down, sink the ship and let you drown. When them done, them run left you. And leave you standing like Daniel in a lion's day. Peter the Niger, after sit and break bread. So how can I just mark? We face and deny we Happy watch we back when them around we Them a wolf in sheep loading around we Them smile in your face Them a snake in the grass 